Now, a motion picture so grand, so magnificent, and so vast, it spans 7,000 years. No way! Yes way! But it starts with Bill. I'm Bill S. Preston! Who was Joan of Arc? And Ted. Noah's wife? We're in danger of flunking most heinously tomorrow. A force from the future. Can we go anywhere we want at any time? You can do anything you want. Is putting history at their fingertips. Let's reach out and touch someone. They're traveling through time. How's it going, royal ugly dudes? Put them in the Iron Maiden. Excellent! Execute them. Bogus. How's it going, dude? And they're making a big impression. Historical babes. Now they're home. Everybody get together, remember who your buddy is. To trash the 20th century. We got a live one here. Keanu Reeves, Alex Winter, Napoleon. We're from history. Billy the Kid. Oh my God. Joan of Arc. Sigmund Freud. Tell me about your mother. You a musician? Beethoven. Genghis Khan! Abraham Lincoln. Party on, dudes! Socrates. George Carlin. We're history. If you guys are really us, what number are we thinking of? 69, dudes! <gasps> Bill and Ted's... Excellent! Excellent! Excellent adventure. Party on, dude. From the SKO Media Group studio in Cuyahoga Falls, Ohio, it's time for the Some Kind of Radio Show. Starring Earl McHugh and the Crazy Crew. Call in or text to 234-200-5110. That's 234-200-5110. Now, here's Earl McHugh and the Crazy Crew. back did you miss us i like that rash it didn't go away i don't know <laughs> like a bad butt rash yeah it's like a bad butt rash we're here we're live seven to ten we have children i don't hear your mic at all okay cool i hear i hear you i don't hear now it helps if I turn my headphones up. Yeah. You got you guys got enough on your headphones? Yep, I'm good. You good, Aaron? Uh, I'm not good, but... Can you hear? Yes. Okay, you hear now? Okay. Yep. Can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? Good. Good. Okay. And that guy switched carriers, you know? Yes, he did. Yeah, he Yeah. What do you go to? He's a sprint now. He's yeah. a sprint he now. For, yeah, I, I, quit, I, I left Verizon over the break here, so uh, switched my carrier, because they got too fucking expensive. Yeah. Well, I'm on Sprint. Why well, should say I'm on T-Mobile now? Yeah, I'm on. Uh, we went to. We're actually on Spectrum Mobile. Yeah. Yeah. We decided to do that. Hi, dear. Hi. Mrs. McCune. Yeah, sorry, right. Mrs. McCune is being. Oh, is that is that the new Mrs.? Yeah. Can't hear it. Hi, You sure? Hi, honey. Talking talking to it. I hear you. Talking to it. I do not hear him. You do not hear him? All right, let's go over to that one. He's, try that he one. He sounds like he's in a faint room. Try, try, try three. Try, try three. Try Mike. Try oh, three. three. Try this one instead. Oh, that's much better. Okay, we'll use three. Oh, much better. Wow. There. Yeah. For some reason two is not doing what it's supposed to be doing, so I'll have to fix two. Move all my stuff wire, over here. Wire. Wire. It's probably wire. something with the wiring, but yeah, you know, things happen. Yeah. I can always. I'll switch the mics on break, and we'll see what happens. It might be a mic. It happens. Ben. <laughs> Tadpole. Hi. Hi. How's everyone doing? Oh, we're here. We're here. And the video is kind of going goofy tonight. And I see it's a video is just not... Well, you could probably blame me for that because this is my first time back in the studio in, oh my God, over almost a year. Yeah. Well, as long as the audio is go, Aaron. As long as the audio is yeah, good. Good job, but, Aaron. Good but job. I, but I am, recording the, I am recording the video tonight. Yep. So the video will be good Regardless. Later. So, regardless, we, we got good audio. It's all I, can, all I, I care about, really, is as long as the audio. Tony here. Here we go. We just scrunch down and hide behind Tony. We're good. Yeah. 
And I miss you guys. I wish I could say the same. <laughs> but after all, what an ass. Thanks. Well, you know, I, it's it's always been about the pepper steak for me, not the orange chicken. Oh, okay. oh, you. oh. Aaron's a oh. pecker steak guy. I'm a pecker steak guy. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Pecker steak. Okay. Wow, yeah, you I said get that the pepper way. steak from the Asian man that you want. Yeah. Wow. Are Everybody's you the Asian hot. man? Secret. No, not me. Asian not, you're, you're not gonna give him your pecker steak. Asian no, you can find it from any other Asian man out there. I was going to say, what's his name? Long Dong Sung? <laughs> Something like that. Long Duck Dong. Oh, my God. Well, well, on, might long... not be as long as he wants, oh but my he'll find God. One. Well, you know, you got to ease it, and it's been a while. I'm still, hey, I'm still a little sore. Hey, remember our video that said Hill Jack will be back? Yep. Yeah, he's not coming back tonight. Okay. No Hill Jack. Yeah, he, uh, the, the, well, he's, he's, uh, isn't he the cause of that? Uh, wasn't he the cause of that uh, big tanker truck fire? No, right? no, no, no. He no. blew a fart and just blew everything. No, away. what happened? Hill Jack told me he twisted his ankle, and uh, he's going to be sitting somewhere on the porch, maybe on the toilet, and he he might try and call in. You I know, don't know, he he was he was talking to me about doing some foot stuff, and I told him you really need to practice first. He's I, in. The, he's I in really the, didn't. I heard he's in the butt stuff. Well, yeah, but he wanted to get into foot stuff, and I told him he needed to practice. I didn't realize he was going to practice on his own feet. Oh my god! So that could have been what happened. Maybe he needs to get into soap. Anyway, get in. <laughs> yeah, he yeah. needs to get into soap and water. We we have an we have a load of shit to talk about tonight. Guys. We, we do. certainly do. We, we do. do. Um, we first of all, Victoria needs to put a shirt on. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> Victoria. I told her to put it on. She declined. Okay, so actually, she needs to put it on and keep it on. That's yeah. the key there. Her bare tatas were screaming. We were testing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we saw. <laughs> yeah, we so, see, we yeah. see things. We 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 may we may not be on, but we watch things. Yeah, yeah. I mean, this wasn't me this wasn't merely because we because we have it on the screen. Everyone can see the screen here. Yeah, you know, this wasn't merely a a, a wardrobe malfunction. This was a wardrobe discombobulation. Yes. 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 Tonight uh, we are going to be talking about things that have been shutting down, like the IX Center here. The yep. IX Center closing down for good. Now yes, this I... this this makes sense. This makes a business sense. Yes. Because when's the last time the IX Center had a show? Been when's forever. the last time that it, it, it was probably if memory serves the the the, the 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 whatever what, what's in what's in October? What's the big? I know the, the no. It's the uh, Santa show in December. IX. Right. Uh, Santa uh, show in December. Indoor. That was probably the uh, no. The, yeah. the amusement park is. Yeah, that would have been around. That would have been around August. That would have been around April. April, yeah. And, right. And they didn't have it this uh, year, obviously. Oh yeah. Right. Because the, we started the shutting down. We started shutting shutting down stuff in March. Yeah, yeah. and then yeah, because <clears throat> that's that's big money for the IX is that we're uh, talking amusement park. We're talking we're talking the auto show like someone just mentioned. Yeah. yeah. We're talking yeah. about the bridal show. We're talking about the flower show. We're talking about the outdoor show. We're talking about the amusement park. All of that just did not happen. And the IX Corporation is still paying money out to the city of Cleveland to lease this to, to lease this this property. Yeah, right. And it's not cheap. They're they're hemorrhaging cash. So on a business stance, it makes sense to close. But they're closing permanently. permanently. They're saying we're done. We're 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 gonna we're gonna shut it down. We're getting out. We're we're ending our lease with the city of Cleveland. We don't care what you do with the property. It's not ours anymore. Yeah, we don't which, own it in the first place. Which for thirty five years was. All of those things, the auto show, the, the IX Center, so on, so, or the, the indoor amusement gonna... park, so on and so forth. Now, a lot of speculation has gone into what are we going to do with this land? The, the common sense thing, you want Mayor Jackson, Mayor Jackson to do common sense things. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my, the, that's funny. The, 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 com Mumbles. the common that's, sense that's thing. That's the funniest shit I've heard all night. I know. The common sense thing would be to raise the land, yeah. extend some of the... Uh, uh, um, Airport uh, runways. The we, runways, thank we, you. That's what you and I talked about. Yeah. And, and and you and I had a very good discussion about the airport runways, and, of course, we had a dis disagreement with Eric on that. And somehow and somehow, Eric seemed to think that, oh, well, we need to put in a domed stadium. No. No. We don't need a domed stadium. For what? I mean. Seriously. I, and and, and that, was my, that was my question. Eric. Yeah. My question to Eric was, for what? Yeah. And, also, and it went unanswered. Yeah, and, and it's going to continue to go unanswered because we don't need a dome stadium in Cleveland. And, no. uh, and also, here's here's the thing too. We didn't and, want one. We didn't want one in the '90s. We don't want one now. And and here's the thing too is they've been trying for years. You know, when they wanted the new arena, is to yeah. get everything in downtown. Yeah. Because uh, you know, I I had hauled a couple of guys uh, from Akron Canton to Burke Lakefront. Sure. Burke is where 
Every professional athlete flies in and out. Absolutely, they do. Everybody with money flies in and out of Berkeley. If you have a private jet, you fly in and out of Berkeley. And then the pro <laughs> sports teams I, charter, that's where their charters fly out and leave because they can they fly in under the veil at night, and that's why you don't see any of them right. getting off unless, like the Cavs went after they won. Right. They, it was, they made it a point to come home during the day to where they could greet their fans. Right. Other than that, the charters fly in and fly out. Yeah. They're under the veil. Nobody sees any of these yeah. guys hustling. Right. And, uh, Exactly, and do it do it under the the guise of night, and uh, yeah, you know, they don't want to be you know hounded. they don't want to be bothered. Yeah, they don't want to be bothered. They want to get in, get out, and get the fuck home. Or and that is exactly going. why the brown the brown state the uh, factory of sadness is where it's at. Yeah, that's right. It, and then uh, it was it was almost sad last night. I mean, they they barely beat the Bungles by five points. Barely beat. I mean, they were ahead. Then the, let's get aggressive. I mean, like, like there was a thing that oh, and I got pizza being delivered to me. Yeah, my, they tried to give my it beautiful away. wife is bringing me pizza. Oh, we have pizza. Thanks, babe. Cheese, hey, Lori, huh? I want some pizza, too. Thanks. Yeah. Where did we get it from? Oh, we did? Did you, what, did you get the other kind? Yeah. I'll, I'll try some of that one. I'll be done with this. You I'll, want a piece I'm of meat? I'll come, I'll come get it. I'm huh? on my way. So, in other Save words, what, er, what Earl is telling all of America right now is that he is going to go later, in, later tonight, he is going to go upstairs and get a slice off of his wife. Thank you. We now have a visual we can't I did that. I did that before you guys got here. Wasn't, what, wasn't that like the entirety of the last month of all our shows? Pretty much. <laughs> and, and, and on Friday just... nights, I was getting a sl- last. Now, see, last Friday, I was not even home. And still I, was, I was gone. I wasn't even, I, was, I was gone. Let's see. We were running some errands. We had to run to my, my in-laws. We had to, I had to set up a Google Home for my father-in-law. And uh, so we were over there for a little bit. We, ran a f- you know, we had to run a few errands, do a few things. We got back in. It's like you know, 10, 30, 11 o'clock. Well, shit, I got to get to bed. I got to work in the morning. You know? Yeah. Whatever. Yeah. <laughs> and that has everything to do with the IX Center that we were talking exactly. about. Exactly. Right? But let's go back but to the IX Center. Yeah. yeah so, so we got into the discussion of the fact that, yes, uh, the, uh, the Cleveland Hopkins Airport is losing money hand over, hand over, hand over fist. Yeah. Because they, pri- pr- uh, public tra- travel has gone away. Yeah, People gone. either don't want to or they can't or it's extremely limited. Now, it's still running. You could still get on a plane, and you can still go yeah. places. I just okay? did. I just did a few weeks ago. And <clears throat> the thing is, I was talking to somebody who just flew to um, Nashville, Tennessee. There's no lines anywhere. Nope. You could get to the oh ticket God, agent. Oh, God, no. You can, in, go through, in and out. you can go through TSA, in and out. You can get to your. You can get, go through the food court. You can get to... Um, get wherever you got to go. I quick. also, yeah, on top of that, I heard that HMS Host laid off a ton of people yep. because they're hemorrhaging cash, too. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Burke is privately owned. Mm-hmm. Burke is a privately owned airport. They fund themselves. Whether or not they're make, losing money hand over fist, it doesn't matter because right. they're flying. They, they continue to fly. And people pl- flying private jets I'll are going to continue to fly private jets yep. because the, who gives a crap about social distancing I'll tell you who, on a 17-foot private jet? I'll tell you whose airport was busier than shit when I landed there. was when I had My connecting flight when I went down to Virginia Beach was Philly. Yep. Philly was freaking jumping. you got to imagine some of the bigger hubs. Mm-hmm. O'Hare, Atlanta, mm-hmm. JFK. Dulles, yeah, LAX, mm-hmm. um, DFW, uh, 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 Reagan, Reagan, um, Reagan Bush, International. yeah, the Bush, Bush, yep. Bush, Bush, Bush International in Houston. So I, I, Those I, are the ones. Yeah. I, I, t- I want to say I, Reagan, but Reagan is not yeah. as big as BWI. Reagan's not big. No, no. BWI is the big hub there. Yeah. yeah, and that's what, and that is what I was trying to get to with the um, with the land that Cleveland is going to inherit once the IX Center Absolutely, is gone. Absolutely, yeah, they're going to. They have that. a chance. I mean, when uh, Continental pulled out of uh, pulled out of Cleveland. Here's a chance to become a hub again and get some more of that transportation down. They need to be a hub because, you know, like right now I flew, I've flown the last couple trips from there. Okay. The, you know, the only, like I went to, I went to Vegas last year with Lori. Okay. Mm-hmm. The only airline offering cross country direct flights is spirit. Yep. Screw that shit. I will uh-huh. never fly that airline again. <laughs> yeah. Well, Ever. I, I fly up because. I don't have a bunch of shit to take with me. Well, it, it's not bad for that, but the seats for four hours? Yeah. Screw Oh, my God. And, of course, I'm sitting next to this. Is I, okay, Lori had the window. I had the middle. And going out, or coming home, I should say, then I had this 350-pound guy just hulking. I'm like, Jesus Christ. why? And, and the plane wasn't even full. I said, can, I, can we do something here? Well, no, you have to stay in your assigned seats. I'm like screw that! You got twenty seats open here. When my son, my my son pissed. and I went to a went to a family reunion in Colorado Springs. Oh man, I could tell stories all day about the, that that trip because that trip was fun and a half. But the trip coming home, 
It was a, it was a night flight. It was a red-eye flight. And there was barely anybody on it. They let he and I have our own row so that he could lay down uh-huh. on, his, on, on the seats and, 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 and fall asleep. Right. Yep. Because he was just of, like, not lap age. So I couldn't sit, I couldn't, you know, go get, get around not buying him a ticket and mm-hmm. saying yeah. he's a lap kid because he wasn't. Right. But, uh, yeah, I hear you. That, that mean, was, but yeah, I mean, again, Cleveland has the opportunity now to buy up that land mm-hmm. and become a hub again. So that's really where they ought to go. But you do have, I have, I have, I have all, all over my Facebook feed was the all the information op- pouring. The other, the other option would be NASA. NASA could always take that over too for something. But they, I don't see that. They don't, I don't see that because NASA's on the other side of the airport. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know, that's where you're going to run into that problem. Right. So, you know. I, 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 Glenn, that, too. It's not a Glenn, place. Glenn is up here. Yeah. And then IX oh, is up here. Oh, that's right. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Okay. My bad. Yeah. So you have the opportunity here oh, to, yeah. to, 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 I'm oh, sorry. Oh, we oh, already oh. got past the opportunity. <laughs> the, the, the memories that everybody's had of the IX Center, what, you know, uh, I've been to the amusement park, what, twice? How, how many times have you been in the amusement park, uh, Earl? In the last 15 years, probably two. Two, twice. How about you? How about you, Shrek? I think once in its existence. Once, mm-hmm. but I've had people that go every year. Um, sometimes it's fun. Sometimes it's like, oh man, I can't it's, get out of here. Yeah. It got to a point when I started. When I started to develop. Last time I went, it sucked. When I started to, to develop my my, I don't want to say phobia, but my, my 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 problems with crowds. That's when it's like I can't do this anymore. I've been to trade shows when I worked for um <clears throat> when I worked for the fluid power company. Yeah. I've been to trade shows. I've been to the my my son went to the the, the auto show every year. Mm-hmm. I'm not a car guy, but you know, yeah. you know he there, he was. It's fun to go. The car show yeah. was the best. That was yeah. awesome. Right, I got dragged to the outdoor show a few yeah. times. The outdoor show is kind of fun. Yeah, you know, there's always that <clears throat> that one that one kiosk that is like that has that Uber like. I'm going to sell you something sure. even though you don't want it and you're going to listen to me because I, I have like a really powerful microphone. Mm-hmm. Um, every show had the hot tub salesman. Oh, absolutely did. You know, even uh, I went to the RV show once. Who's been to the RV show? Never been to it. I loved I've it. I've always wanted to go, but I went that was so much fun. Yeah, I went to the RV show just to see I want this, but I'll never own it. Right. Because I spend so much money having fun doing this. But uh, I, right. it's... So, you know, a lot of memories going into that, but yeah. a lot of time, and this is what, this is what is happening with the last nine months, last six months or yeah. so, in that businesses are closing down, things are closing down. Mm-hmm. And it's not so much the big businesses. I mean, you know, if Walmart ever closed down, I don't think people are going to have the fond memories or it's miss still, it like that. Yeah, it's but, when you have, but when you have like the mom and pop restaurants and, and shops and things like that, that just couldn't make it through. And we're struggling. Our, our business where I'm at, we're, we're, we're barely scraping by right now. Absolutely. There's a, uh, there's a, there's a bagel and deli place down the street from me that closed down, uh, middle of July. And because one of their, uh, one of their folks came down with the, with the COVID, right. They have yet to open it back up. And it's a shame because it's, yeah. it's literally the only place in Medina County where I can get a decent bagel. If I want any, if I want anything decent, decent bagel, I'm not talking about store bought. I have to go north to, to, to Avon to go to Barry's or east to, you know, Little Israel to get just about anywhere. Bialy's, mm-hmm. um, right. uh, Jack's, uh, Corky and Lenny's, right. places like that. Yeah. But that's kind of a haul for a bagel. Exactly. But that's what's happening here is a lot of these, these smaller places, a lot of things are closing down. And you see, you, you, one of the things is you remember we, we were talking about Bill and Ted back to Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. We're talking about venturing back to the future and mm-hmm. things like that. And, I, and I'm remiss to say, you know, we look at what the future looked like in these movies t- right. 30, 40 years ago. Oh, God, yeah. And we're thinking to ourselves, what happened then? Mm-hmm. We we're are th- in the precipice of, thank you, we are in the precipice of a, of a future we envisioned where people don't have to leave their houses to do a whole lot. We right. have. <laughs> thank you, <Yeah. laughs> Shrek. Yeah. Shrek's phone's going off over here. Yeah. Um, I think I thought I heard Holly too. Oh yeah. She's oh, up the there. dogs are in full force. Um, but you know, you know, we we we've got we've got distance learning, we've got yeah. distance working, we've Everything. got distance minis. Yeah. You know, we we have we have Ben smoking his hookah and on the um, <laughs> on, on line here, not sharing with anybody. You know, puff puff pass, please. Um, 
And that's the thing. Where's the beers at? I don't see any beers flowing here. It's just my jewel going on. Ben, 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 you got the beers flowing too? Yeah. Bless your heart. Ben, Ben always. Somebody's got a beer. Somebody's got a beer flowing. I'm. I had the day off, and I took a long weekend because. Well, let's shit. let's clarify this for a moment here. He doesn't have the beer going. He's drinking Miller Light. <laughs> well, it's better than what he used to drink. Yeah. What was he drinking? Light? He used to drink Bud Light. Light. <laughs> uh, okay. So he's stepped up a that's, little bit. That, that's why he's drinking a hookah to get rid of that taste. <laughs> um, <laughs> but this was something. Jewel, come on now. Th- this was something know, that Arthur C. Clarke envisioned day. when he did his. You're still doing the pad in the new hot mic. I love that. <laughs> This is what we're going to talk about later. Um, we uh, this is what Arthur C. Clarke envisioned when he talked about when he talked about the stuff that he wrote, you know, yeah. back in the in the sixties and seventies. Mm-hmm. And, and this right. is the future, you know. Mm-hmm. Can you turn that down? I am, hold on. <laughs> There's a volume button on the side. Select it. What a great co-host you are, Tony. Tell he's you. all over it tonight. He, he's, he, he's 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 you know what it is? It's 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 it, it's uh it's it's Mike Rust. He's got Mike Rust going. Yeah, I'm telling you, you go off. For, you go off for three weeks, and all later, of a sudden right? it's like you know with wrestling, just ring rust. rust. He's got Mike Rust. Yeah. <laughs> well, somebody's like, well, what do I got to do to watch the feed? And I'm like, don't you go to go to some kind of radio show? Go to go our to the Facebook yeah. page. Go to the Facebook page. Right. Yeah, I just I just I just copied and pasted the link to someone. So it's really yeah. you know. So here you go. Watch Control the thing. C, Control V. There you go. Watch I saw, it. I saw that somebody had a t somebody had a t shirt like that. Dad yeah. was wearing Control C. The son was wearing Control V. That's funny. I love that. I wanted to get oh that for. Uh, I wanted to get that, but I never. Uh, it's on my wish list. But they, uh, that's one subject we hit on tonight. And tonight, I, I do want to kind of hit into this. Uh, at the end of this hour, you know, we've been teasing. We, this. we want to start talking about that in about ten minutes or so. Yeah, something. exactly. We got a lot to talk about about that. Yes, we do. We we have a big teaser announcement. We have big announcements. And everyone and everyone here, I didn't tell everybody here because I want everyone to be surprised, just like everybody else. And everybody, I, I swear to God, you guys are all gonna love it. I, I promise you guys, you're gonna love it. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be great. So we'll, so we talk- at, at, before the eight o'clock hour, we will we will make our announcement we'll on what the announcement is. But we'll start talking about it here after we come back after seven thirty. A little bit, just teases, little snippets. But at 8 o'clock, we'll pull out, and then after the 8 o'clock hour, we will go into it and talk about it and talk about it, because we're going to have a lot of fun talking about oh, it. Oh, absolutely. Uh, it's a, it's that's a, a tease for you, host. That's there it. It's a cock tease for you, Ben. Ben should be used to that by now. Him and his orange chicken. That's, so, why, that's why his chicken is orange. Because <laughs> he's been teasing it. Blue, it. But... No, yeah. that's, that, th- those are the nuggets. Yeah. Oh. Victoria, you cannot mute to laugh. It's okay. <laughs> yeah, we see you. We see you. She's Victoria's, la- she's, Victoria's trying not to laugh. Come on, Victoria. Up. Come on. Yeah, crack, crack up with us. It's all part of the game. Yeah. yeah you can Vic- laugh, Victoria, so. Victoria's a little bit upset because, you know, she still wants to go topless and we won't let her. <laughs> I don't think Facebook I, I, would allow it. I, yeah, we. Well, you, you, well, thought, you thought Facebook jail was bad for 24 happened. hours. I got Facebook jail the other day. I know. That's what I was, that's what I I was, was leading so into. pissed. Earl got Facebook jail this week. For the first time in my life, I got Facebook jail. But let, let's finish this half hour here because we, yes. are doing, we are doing Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. I did want to at least crawl, crawl into the new movie. You want to crawl into it? I want to crawl into it. Let's crawl into it a little you, bit. You know what? I am grateful that we are, we're, we're, we're getting back at making, fun of, uh, at making fun of Aaron this week. Yes. Because there was... Uh, there was a teaser about uh, Elton John yeah. um, releasing uh, a, a, a demos of some of his old songs. Oh, really? And I talked, I, and I, I text Mike about this, and I said, yeah. "Have you seen this?" Yeah. And of course, the big faux pas from back in the uh, from back in the Manpocalypse days was, you know, we were comparing, you know, some of the penises. Artists. Were you guys no, comparing we were, penises? We were, yeah, and I lost <laughs> incredibly. I lost. Um, Not surprised. We were comparing by a hair, we, by a hair, <laughs> two hairs actually. <laughs> And I had them both trimmed, so I'm going to lose you know, incredibly. <laughs> uh, we were talking about artists that influenced us in our youths. You know, you know, artists we grew yes, up with. Yes. And I made the mistake of saying exactly this into a hot mic. Elton John touched me as a child. <laughs> and well, that's Mike, not... okay. And Mike never let that go. To this day, he still talks about how Elton John touched me as a boy. I wouldn't, I wouldn't let that go either. So and Now that I heard that, I definitely won't let that go so now. It's, You're it's, welcome. It's, it's, still, it's, still, it's still pick on Aaron Day. But... I watched. Yes, I'm spring for breeze, and it's not because I farted, because it still smells like a dog down here. I, I watched the, um, the <laughs> three, new movie. Three weeks of dogs coming down here. I watched the new movie when it came out. The day it came out. Yes, I okay. watched it too, so I understand the movie. And I you wanted. Seen it? You I, seen it yet? Yeah. Okay, so I we've wa- all seen it. I okay. wanted to go into this movie with a positive attitude. 
I tried. And as soon as I realized, the, this is a movie that if you enjoy Bill and Ted, you are going to enjoy this movie. If you enjoy Keanu Reeves, you're going to hate it. Yeah. Okay? And the reason being is because Alex Winter, it, the, 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 the characters are still acting like they're 17 years old. Yeah. They're still they did, acting they like they're grow in high up. school. They didn't grow up. They yeah. grew old, but they didn't grow up. Yeah. Okay? Alex Winter pulls off the, the 50-year-old 17, the, the 50-year-old teenager perfectly. He does Because it. he hasn't done anything since. No. Barely anything since. Yeah. Keanu has been in all the Matrix movies, all the John Wick's movies. Oh. The, the, he's been the action hero. That movie was like watching John Wick without the beard. Exactly. Yeah, that's what I felt like. Cause exactly. Because here's like, the thing. If you go back to the old days, Keanu Reeves' voice didn't really change until he got a little older. Right. But Keanu had that little higher pitch. The now you can hear the speed. old rundown voice that you know Keanu's starting to get. Uh, I'm trying to... You know, we, we gotta save the world. I'm yeah. like, we have to save the dude. world, but there is no spoon. Yeah, but you know, it's just you know, he, it, you could, he sounds old now, right? Yeah, and just he looked so unnatural as Ted. The the, the only thing I can liken it to is when you watched um, Star Wars Episode Seven. Okay. Okay. Um, a fourth of Force Awakens, and Harrison Ford came back as Han Solo. Right. You knew there was nobody else that was going to play that part, mm -hmm. but he was way too old to play that part. Yeah. Yes. This, uh, you, you saw Han Solo that really should have stopped doing anything, yeah. should have taken his smuggling earnings. And, and retired. And retired, retired yes. on a beach somewhere. Exactly. Not, not still running, right. you know, you, you know, running uh, Gunthars. Yeah, yes. Exactly. So no more Han Solo. We can make it like Foot Solo or yeah. something. Oh, God. It was... And that's why we call him the comedy killer, ladies and <laughs> gentlemen. And on that note... No, know, yes. but it was like, you know, like, for me, I know everybody that likes Keanu. Yeah. My favorite role of his was in The Replacements. Great movie. Yes. Great movie. I love Gene that Hackman. movie. With Gene Hackman. Yes. I was still trying to find a, a, a Shane Falco jersey, because, like, I have my Bobby Boucher jersey. Mm -hmm. Get one made. Uh, well, and the only ones that I can find on eBay are friggin' from China. And I'm no, not... get one made. There, there, there are a ton of places that will that, that have blank jerseys that you, you can customize. Yeah, but I want to. I don't he, know. he wants the I Washington wanna, Capitals logo. The Washington Generals. Washington logo. Generals. I'm sorry, I thought it was Washington. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Capitals. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry. Whatever though. Here's oh, our sports guy, yeah. uh, Earl McCune. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's sports ball, ladies and gentlemen. No, nothing's worse. Nothing's worse than if you got to play the Washington football team this year. Yes. Good lord, have you heard they're actually thinking of like making that permanent? The Washington football. The team. football. The Washington football team. Their mascot is going to be the football team. I'm done. Yeah, I mean, I, I just... I am pretty much done. Thank you very much. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Well, it's like my Braves. They're like, okay, well, are, uh, I'm like, Braves could, Brave could be anything. And in, the, and, and in Kansas City, you're no longer allowed to uh, pay, face paint right. or do the chop. Yeah. And on that note... On that note... Yeah. On that note... On that note... On that note... Yeah. Keanu's still 2020, old. the year that sucked. The 2020, the year, you know, could we have like, uh, you know, a, you know, well, everyone says, how can we just get a rewind and do it over? No, I don't want to do this year over. Let's just get past this shit. You see, I saw the t-shirt that says 2020, half a star, mm -hmm. really bad, wouldn't recommend. Like, yeah. a, like well, a Yelp review. When we come back, I, I do want to talk about something I saw on the Wines press conference yesterday. I, oh, Lord. I, I, I have to hit on this. The shit show that was. The shit show that was. Because I, I do want to talk about this, too, when we come back. Summit County uh -huh. went from being red, skipped <laughs> right over yellow, or down to orange, skipped right over orange, right down to yellow. So how do you drop two yeah. in a week? Suddenly we're yellow, and we're the only county yellow. All the college kids move out? Yeah. Well, I don't know. Yeah. And Portage County because went red. Portage County, County went red. County's because all red, the college, so Port, because, because college kids. Because all the college kids it. moved back. Yeah. And you want to talk about something legendary that's going down like the IX Center? The Highland Tavern. I've heard about yeah. We'll, we'll talk, talk about, about that. that when we come back too. Absolutely, we got, got a lot of info. We on got that. a lot to talk about tonight. And again, like I said, big announcement coming just before eight o'clock, and uh, we're you're gonna love that. So let's take our first break and uh, play our first clip from Bill and Ted's excellent adventure. Some kind of radio show coming at you live, Facebook Live. We'll be back.
Hey, sweetie poo. It looks like I'll be running a little late tonight. I got a meeting of all okay. the Okay. Okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. So anyway, I'll be a little late, okay? Oh, it's okay. I'll miss you too. I can't wait to snuggle. <laughs> Honey, I got out on time after all. Yeah, meeting got postponed. Turns out we really didn't even need to. Oh my god. Sunny side up and oh fucking shit! You wanna know the secret how to get that shit off? Use your fingernails. And there you are, motherfucker. Hey, it's your girl Kathy, and I got some brand new shit. You better peep this. My shit don't stick. What are you making eggs? Are you cooking for robots? Beep boop beep. Most people can't stand this sound, but I can listen to it forever. Watch me now. Hey, yep. You even lift, bro. Speed bump. Whoa! Look out, Spider Man. I got that symbiote. Yeah, I bet you want some of that sticky monkey red, monkey looking motherfucker. Me? Well, you know I like to keep my monkey hot. Now don't burn yourself now, cause that shit's fire. Then I slide into the plate like whoa. This my original recipe. Thank Chicky Nuggies. I have infused this pan with the power of red copper. Hey, you wanna see some real shit? This is how I pick up a sandwich. Try that shit at home. I'm saving time and money. Whipping these eggs. Whipping and whipping these eggs. Then I drop a mac and cheese bomb on them. Woo! And the kids love it. That turned out all right. All right, let's send these boys home to mama. Just look at all that sweet sugar caramelizing over these nuts. And it's so easy to clean. It rip, it rip, remix. Flip it round and flip it. Flip it on upside down. Biscuits, you just got served. Breakfast. It's been real, Copper Pan. And you can buy yours today for $19.99. God damn. That's a good deal. Pay an extra $10 and I'll throw on my recipe book for free. And it's built to last. Hey, that's my fucking pan. Give me your money, you cheap prick. Fuck it, I'll even throw in the forever sharp copper knife. You know what would go great with this rock? Some tomato. Some kind of radio show will be back in a moment. Welcome to the future. San Dimas, California, 2688. And I'm telling you, it's great here. The air is clean, the water's clean. Even the dirt is clean. Bowling averages are way up. Mini golf scores are way down. And we have more excellent water slides than any other planet we communicate with. I'm telling you, this place is great. But it almost wasn't. You see, 700 years ago, the two great ones ran into a few problems. So now I have to travel back in time to help them out. If I should fail to keep these two on the correct path, the basis of our society will be in danger. Don't worry, it'll all make sense. I'm a professional. I'm Bill S. Preston, Esquire! And I'm Ted... Oh, Bill, here, you take it. Okay. Guess we use too much power. I like it. Ted, 
while I agree that in time our band will be most triumphant, the truth is, Wild Stallions will never be a super band until we have Eddie Van Halen on guitar. Yes, Bill, but I do not believe we will get Eddie Van Halen until we have a triumphant video. Ted, it's pointless to have a triumphant video before we even have decent instruments. Well, how can we have decent instruments when we don't really even know how to play? That is why we need Eddie Van Halen. And that is why we need a triumphant video. Excellent! You are tuned into the Some Kind of Radio Show. Call now at 234 200 5110. Now, back to Earl McHugh and the Crazy Crew. All right, we're back. It is uh, 735 here on the East Coast. And uh, one quick announcement here, real quick. Uh, nothing related to anything we're talking about tonight, but. Earl broke his bottle opener. I broke my bottle opener first. Second thing. Well, that wasn't the announcement. That second thing. I thought that was an announcement. Our good about. friend Troy Froman yes. has been cast in episode number 10 of the new Saved by the Bell. Awesome. Yes. He's gonna. Yes. He's got a small part in the 10th episode coming up. So I'm really... I wanted to say quick congrats to our friend Troy. Congrats, Troy. Yeah. And it's uh, be nice good. to hear from him. Uh, yeah. I haven't talked to him and talked to him, talked to him in a while. I've talked to him on Facebook every now and then. Yeah. But I haven't really talked to him. He's been real busy. I mean, with the restaurant, they're doing a lot of, you know, delivery, all that stuff. And, you know, California is what it is right now. So, so hope he's, I'm just glad he's doing okay. And uh, then also him. How can get, we sleep when the woods but, are uh, burning? Not sure yeah. if he's, not sure if he's going to play. Ox or Scud, and he cannot say. He will not tell me. Because the reason is he's got a confidential agreement with NBC, so he can't yeah. do it. But uh, exciting news. Glad to see he's going to be back doing the character that really kind of got him where he was. Uh, people has, know him from. Has, has anyone actually had a chance to peruse the Peacock uh, yes. uh, streaming site? I have, I have. I use it on my phone all the time. I like. What are your thoughts? I like it. It's not bad. I mean, Why? Because you can get a lot of shit on there that you can't find anywhere else. Okay, so you're looking for it for some of the. I like the stuff. older stuff. I don't really give a shit about NBC's current programming list. Okay. I don't watch it. But can you like watch older episodes like Cheers? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Well, Cheers is actually I think through who's distributing CBS is distributing okay. Cheers. Okay. And but, it was on NBC, but yes, Cheers is on. But is, is, yeah, but CBS <coughs> owns, owns okay owns company, the rights to it. Owns rights to it. Okay. But like, I, there's a lot of old shows uh, that you can get on it. Uh, there's a lot of stuff. Um, I've watched, you know, good old one, Sequest. Mm -hmm. You can okay. watch that on the Peacock. I mean, I like that kind of show. And here's I, here's I, here's my take on it. Okay. It's confusing. It's lackluster. It took them entirely too long to get any type of sports program whatsoever. Mm -hmm. And even at that, it's all you know. There's there's very little choice in any type of live programming. In comparison to CBS All Access. I like it because a it's free. Right. CBS All Access, not a bad thing. I pay for it. Forget. I'm going to get it again for the Star Trek coming out next month. Uh, Discovery yeah. season three, and I do want to see it. Uh, and Picard I, season two. I watched Picard. Yeah, I want. I watched Picard season one, but tough ending. It's oh a very my tough God. ending. I yeah, everybody. I'm hung up ahead, on it. Go go ahead and make fun of my testosterone levels. I'm that, hung up. That I'm season very ending, hung, I'm very hung up like on it. Girl. I was. I did too. But at the same time, I was very dissatisfied. I mean, great ending for Data's character. Right. But they could have, with the, the CGI technology, they could have brought him back, and then even if he wasn't on the show, he could go off and do some other shit. Yeah. But now, that's that when, when they went back and sang uh, Blue Skies, mm -hmm. which you'll go back to um, the very first Troy, episode. Troy, no, Troy and uh, oh, yeah, uh, that was Riker's from, that Wedding. Was, that was from Nemesis. Uh, from Nemesis. Mm -hmm. Okay. Where that came from, the uh, very beautiful rendition Absolutely. of that song, and that's probably what did it for me. Yeah, when they put that whole thing behind that song and had that actress singing it, yeah. that's where I'm like, okay, I'm either going to turn this off or I'm just going to sit on the couch alone. Well, and cry. the girl that sung it was the girl that played his daughter, yes, Brianna. Mm -hmm. her boy, I can't remember to pronounce her name, but uh, she she that was a beautiful rendition of that song. When I speak later of the library, you'll know what I'm talking yeah, about. Yeah, that was a beautiful. very beautiful. I, I, I tossed yeah. the idea of putting that in the library. But yeah, we'll we'll talk about that in a minute. Yeah, we'll talk about yeah. that in a minute. We had um, Brasana. I can't not pronounce her fucking name to save my life. But no, I know. But to the internet, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. But uh, be beautiful rendition. But anyway, uh, mm -hmm. I, I that was my one diverge. Now we can kind of get back to what we were going to talk about. Tony, take it away. The Highland Tavern. Yes. And, and uh, let's see here. 
For, now, for those that don't know, Fu- I call him Fuhrer DeWine because he's kind of so do I because he's kind of been running Ohio like a like the third like the fourth Reich here. Uh, you know, oh, oh, what was it? what's it been about a month now that the bars have had uh, about five or six weeks. About five or six weeks. Mm-hmm. Oh, the ten o'clock curfew. Bars have to quit serving alcohol at ten o'clock. I know we got so, we got to stop serving at ten ourselves at the and, bowling center, and that kills us. And then it's got to be off the tables by eleven by eleven o'clock. Now there's been a bar, and I know like the place I go karaoke at on Sunday nights is Frank's. Right. I actually hauled Frank himself, and I've I never met the guy. Right. I hauled him uh, about a week ago. He was going to a fantasy football draft at another bar. Okay. And he happened to mention, hey, uh, you know, uh, do you happen to pop into Frank's at all? And I said Sunday nights regularly for wings and uh, yeah. karaoke. Okay. And, you know, I gave him a good review on karaoke. You're yeah. welcome, Warry. And uh, <laughs> and he had asked me if I had heard about, about the Highland because they're the, for them, yeah. at, the t- at the time, right. Bars were only getting cited, 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 fine, fine, fine. It was fine. It, little bullshit fines, like 200 bucks. Yeah, but it was enough money to where these bars could serve and keep selling and, you know, stay open until mm-hmm. 11. And if they got caught, they'd just pay the fine. Well, right. apparently the Highland Tavern, five, six, seven times, well, yeah. finally they went in front of the state. The well, state voted. That. Yeah. And what I heard, too, they started locking their doors at 10. Yeah. And so I, I guess from what I heard, when they actually got lost their license, the liquor control was at the door pounding, and they wouldn't let them in. Yep, I was getting, I was getting to that. Yeah, yeah. When the liquor control people were there to snoop, they 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 weren't being let in. Mm-hmm. Number one, that's a bad move right there. I mean, even if it's your first offense, right? You, you got to let them in. You got to let them in. You got to cooperate. Got to cooperate. That's your li- liquor. Where license. have I heard that before? Hmm. Yeah. Cooperate yeah. with law enforcement. Yeah, 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 yeah exactly. So, uh, so, the, so finally, after multiple violations, yeah. the Highland, you know, they went in front of the Liquor Control Board, and, the, and they voted to revoke, not suspend. Revoke. 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 Gone. Gone. And, and October 2nd is their last day of their life. Which will be a Saturday. Right. So out of their stock, and then they have to close. And here's the thing. When you buy a bar, you buy a liquor license from the state. Absolutely. Guess what? You don't get a refund. You don't get a refund. You don't get a refund. Get a refund. So that's, that license is going to go back to the state. It's going to open the, up another license for something. For the state to resell it. That's the, that's the biggest asset any bar owns is their liquor license. Yep. Without, with, without question. Without question. That's adding up all your booze, all your equipment, all your stock. That license is your – that's your key. That's your key. So now, now this bar Earl, we, we still have our liquor license, right? We can still – yeah, sure. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So, sure. sure. Yeah. <laughs> because <laughs> liquor. Because we have, our, we have our license to drink it. There you go. Yeah. We just don't have our license to sell it. Just like the sign says, mm. possessing an alcoholic beverage on these premises is it, encouraged. It is encouraged, and it always has been. Always has been. Now, but, uh, to, bra- to break in for a second, Isabella Camille Brion. Okay. B R I O N E S. Okay. Born January 17th, 1999. Wow. She's Sam's age. My God. Holy crap. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I, I, old. I, I, have, I have to stop right there. That was, by the way, I, speaking of liquor licenses and stuff, that was actually a really good time. Took Sam out for his first legal drink. Mm-hmm. Uh, we went to Geeked Out. Mm-hmm. I've, I've talked about that uh, a number of times on the old show. Um, and he wanted so desperately to try their butterbeer. Mm-hmm. What he was not aware of, and I sent him. I sent him a PDF of the drink menu. Right. I said, here's what, choose. And he's like, I've already choose. This is what I've wanted to, since, since I knew I was going to be turning 21 soon. Mm-hmm. What he was not aware of was that, what, and I, he was aware that it contained spice rum. It contained pe- Captain Morgan. Right. He has never had Captain Morgan before. Oh, no shit. So he drank, the, he drank a little bit of the butter beer, and he's like, I don't like this. Mm-hmm. I like, he, he drank the non-alcohol one, non- non-alcoholic ones before. Right, right. But he didn't like the alcoholic ones. He said, what's in it? I was like, well, I, I gave him the drink menu that was sitting there. And I'm like, read again. And he's like, what's spiced rum? I'm like, Captain, Captain Mor- Morgan. I'm, I'm sorry. It was like, what's Captain Morgan? I said, it's spiced rum. Mm-hmm. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, wow. So he went to something else. Mm-hmm. And it's, it, it's, uh, it, it, was, it was a really good time. We, we, shared, we shared drinks together. And we sat there. It, it, the, uh, and I'm still not used fun. to seeing Aaron with a beer in front of him. Yeah. It's, it's, <laughs> we'll, we'll get to that in a second because it's going to segue into, into yes. another thing. Um, 
I did, I'm not a quitter, folks. I, you know, I did, I did give it up for a little bit on the last program. Remember, I said I wasn't drinking anymore. Well, I'm having a few. I'm not. I'm not getting stupid, but I'm having one or two. And um, and and the 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 the, the restaurant was very spaced out. There was there the, the the tables were very well apart, and you know everybody was wearing masks, and and it was it was a really it, they're doing their best yeah. to try to keep up with the times, and they're 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 struggling too. You know, uh, we've become really good friends with you. We, we're not friends with the owners, but you know we're acquaintances with the yeah, owners. They you know, know us. Yeah. We, we we talk to them on Facebook, and they know who we are. Right. Um, so much so that, um, I've been trying to my we've been trying to plan my fiftieth birthday party there as well. Right. Which is going to be everybody. Everybody thinks it's like, oh, here's your chance to get messy. <clears throat> yes, during the um, lockdown. Yeah. I started drinking again. Yeah. Um, I'm not going to apologize for it. You shouldn't have. I'm to. not going to, you know, try to justify it. You're a grown ass man. It it was, you know, everybody has had their ha- had to deal with the lockdown. Yeah. In ways that they could. Right. Um. I, uh, you know, I had. Uh, I had kept a, a bottle of uh, Glenlivet in the house for you know guests, whatever. Right. And I just there 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 came a weekend where it's like I can have one mm-hmm. because after what was it twenty three years twenty three years of sobriety I learned one thing mm-hmm. don't get messy. Right. And I've never in, in the in the time that I've been drinking I've never had more than a drink. That's true. And every time I've had a drink with you recently, we've had one, one drink, drink together. Yep. I, uh, Mike shared a, uh, when, when we had the uh, bachelor party, mm-hmm. Mike wanted to have a drink with me. So we shared one of those, whatever he brought in a can. It was like White Claw, but yeah. not. Yeah. Um, it was awful. It, it, was something, it was something you give up your man card for. I'll, yeah. I'll just say that. It was one of those seltzers. Yes. And uh, It was something like Ben would drink. Right. <laughs> it's a, it was a Ben drink. Yeah. You mean Dylan? Because oh, no, Dylan, 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 Dylan would drink the shit out of that. Yeah, Dylan. Yeah. Dylan, yeah. Dylan and I, and I, I have photographic evidence of that, too. Yeah. Yeah. Well, going, going, back drink. To, back to, going back to the old days, the first time no. I met Dylan, he was completely hammered. Yeah. I mean, just foobar. And it was the day that the, Cav, the, the Cleveland Cavaliers got bounced out of the playoffs, and that's why he right. got, got, got all messy. Yeah. And I think that was kind of a catalyst. It's like, well, he's like 19. Or whatever. Right. So, you know, he's young. At the time, he was like 19, maybe 20. Yeah, yeah probably 20 he, he was young. Well, you playing you know. footsie with me. Yes. Yeah, well, okay. you're bringing Thanks. him over here, so. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just stretching out for him. Here, here's the fun part. You thought that was my foot. Ooh, uh, hey now. <laughs> hey. Hey now. Hey now. So, hey now. So, you know, it, it's, it's, it, it's nice to be able to sit here and have a beer with you guys and have a beer with Mike and just, mm-hmm. you know, be guys again. And not have to think about, okay, well, we got to get FUBAR. Yeah. Well, it's like, you know, I, I started talking to this gal named Patty. Mm-hmm. And, uh, Patio Furniture. <laughs> maybe around St. Patty's Day. <laughs> <laughs> but, so, example, when I told her, I said, I was like, I hardly drink anymore. I'm right. like, Earl seen me have a few drinks. Yeah, a couple here and there. I've had a couple here and there, but I mean, as a general rule, like, I had said, if I go out and get a steak, if I go out into a steakhouse and get a steak, yeah. I either have a beer or a glass of wine with it. No matter what. Steak, I do a nice Cabernet. Yeah, I mean, yeah. steak, either it's either a red wine yeah. or, or I'll have a beer, depending upon my mood. Depending on the mood, right? yep. But for the most part, you know, on the weekends, I mean, my going out and partying days are way past me. Way oh, yeah. past Yeah, me too. Way past me, yeah. and it's just like... I hear you. You know, and I, you know, even the last couple of years that I've wanted to go out for Halloween run for my birthday, you know, I've had no DD, so mm. guess who hasn't went out? And it's just like, yeah. you know, if I have one this year... Yeah, I'm probably going to go out and have a few and a few and a few and a few more. Right. And just, you know, because I think the last time I was, last, you know, last Thursday, yeah. um, my karaoke DJ uh, went out with a friend of hers, and I was yeah. her private Uber. Oh, nice. I dropped him off. The, she gave me 50 bucks and said, drop us off this time. Pick us up at 11 o'clock when the bar closes. And she and this was the first time I talked to her away from her husband. Right. Because she was like, you know, because she was pretty lit when oh I picked him up. Oh, my. And because uh, she, because because Lori was asking me like the first time she, I, I told her I'm like you know I remember the first time I met her mm-hmm. we popped in for like a half hour to do karaoke when mm-hmm. they were having a Halloween party right and I was dressed as Austin Powers and mm-hmm. uh, I showed her the picture and she's like that was you because <laughs> and I, I didn't know at the time she was married I mm-hmm. mean and I just remember she was like yeah you kept on coming over and smacking and grabbing my rear end <laughs> and I mean, all she that she was grabbing yours you were grabbing hers both. <laughs> 
It was a touchy feely type I, of situation. I, so, I, I almost didn't want to ask, and now I'm uh, grateful I didn't. Because because <laughs> because uh, Lori's hubby works for the post office. Oh. So I always call him Cliff Clavin. <laughs> Cliff, Cliff. Because one day he was he happened to be there, and he Norm. was in, the Norm is the one that always got his name yelled out. Yeah. No. You kind of remind me of a Norm. I could be. Or it's like, you know, hey... Uh, remember, the, remember this from the old show? Joe! Joe! Yeah. Oh, my God, Joe! Joe. Remember that? <laughs> I think... I think... Right. I, love, I love your story, but I think... Starting to talk about the old show. Yes. We need to touch on this. Yes, we do. We do. It's, it's because, 10 Hill, so we got to start touching on it. Because we got to start touching it. Mm-hmm. Ooh. The, hey, uh, uh, speak, speak, speaking of touching, can I break in here for a, uh, a, an important hey, news break? Hello. Yeah, news break. All right. Hit it. Okay. Uh, Supreme Court Justice Ruth Gator Bader Ginsburg just died. Oh, holy shit! And she, I thought she's she'd been in the Walking Dead for years. Yeah, yeah. Well, she officially died today. Oh, okay. Uh, like, sorry to hear. Do you have official news confirmation on this because I'm not finding it anywhere. <sighs> it's coming across my phone, breaking everywhere. Well, let's see here. Uh, I'm looking at my phone and I'm not seeing nothing. Well, Let me get into it. Minute. We'll double check it. Yeah, we have to. Yeah, just give me across my channel 12, channel 12 local news, AOL news. Yes, it's official. It's official. Yep, I see it too. Okay. Wow. I just want to make sure that we're not putting out fake news out there. No, John's not. Uh, that's not Eric. No, if we were, if we were going to put out fake news, we'd take our shirts off, Victoria. <laughs> but no, thank you for checking that. But uh, anyway. I'll, I'll get there in a minute. Uh, Ben's, Ben's ready to get his shirt off. We well, already got your jacket he's, off. You're getting there. Ben's ready to rock out with his hard hot. He's ready to get it on with his rock hard cock out for everybody. Yeah, I'm just waiting for Victoria to join in with me. Can't do it alone. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. I thought you had a woman. Had, uh, past tense. No, no, I don't. You What? Had, past tense. Had. I, am I, am yeah. I missing something here? You and I have probably about. Four hours to talk and catch up, my friend. Oh, we got a lot to uh, catch up on there. We, we yeah. need to uh, get together and have beverages soon. We need to put them on the patio. Yeah. We need yeah. to have you over, and we'll, we will sit down on the patio, we and we'll light the, the fire, and uh, Dude, we, we, we will cook been... some steaks and burgers and uh, have many a beers, and we will discuss things. It has been a hell of a month. I'm sorry, Thank buddy. You. I did not know. Oh, no, 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 no. You're good. No, no. Yeah. I took today off and Monday off. Oh, okay. Ooh. I'm uh, sorry, buddy. I did not know, my friend. Hey, that's the life of... That's, that's, why, he's, that's why he's trying to flirt with me. Yeah. Now I wonder why you were trying to flirt with Eric. Okay, so, so anyway, going back to... Okay, we, we were talking about... Big news. We were talking Big about the news. old show. Yeah. I want to hear this news. Okay. We were talking about the old show. We were talking about the old show. And first. over the past couple of weeks, we've been getting together. We've been reminiscing about the old show. A lot. Like a, a lot. I'm sharing old some show. old stuff, pictures, and clips... You know, and, and yeah, pictures, clips, and, and the general how it went, mm-hmm. you know, I mean, how things were, how happy we were, you know, how much fun we had, oh, sure. yeah. know, what, what a blast it was, yeah. your show, our old show, all of them put together, the music, the, you know, yeah, everything Tony that was, show, yeah, yeah. all the fun stuff, yeah. Yeah. Tony, Tony snoring into the microphone, it was <laughs> yeah. great, um, <laughs> And even, even Ben and friends, had, you know, yeah, we, yeah, Ben had a show. Yeah, I got to, yeah. I get to call in and be Ben's friend, you know, <laughs> yeah. with, without all, with, with, without, Dude. without the, without the reach around. So, <laughs> it, it dawned on us last week. Yeah, we were here sitting around this table, mm-hmm. and we watched what I could only describe is the epitome of a shit show. Yes, because our, my biggest concern when we started talking about this. <coughs> Mm-hmm. Was that when we had to close down SKO? Yeah, it felt like the death of internet radio, at least in Northeast Ohio. Oh, I, if yeah, not, definitely. If if not in you know in general, I agreed because we put our heart and our soul and our and our bodies Absolutely. into this, and people who weren't on board with how committed we were yeah. to doing things right, to doing things, you know, the way they should be done, to putting out the product that was going that was going to drive people into the st- station and did. Yes. Went off and tried to do their own thing. Right. And failed fracking miserably. Miserably, yeah. Absolutely miserably. We watched one show where, into a hot mic, Mm -hmm. the host, Mm -hmm. after minutes of dead air, said, I don't know what I'm doing. (laughs) Twice. Yeah. Yeah. The host did this twice. In the same show, the co-host... During some 
you know, monotone dialogue, mm -hmm. fell asleep. Yeah, I know. <laughs> We had one of our. I never fell we had, asleep. We, on we had track. one of our alumni yeah. oh, sit here <laughs> and and try to create a new company mm -hmm. every other week. Hey, I'm going to do this. Hey, I'm going to do that. <laughs> and and all in all, couldn't even couldn't even put two and two together about what you need to do to run a radio station. Mm -hmm. And we're watching this, and we're thinking th our biggest problem was licensing. That was our. Oh, that, that, that was really our only that problem. That was the catalyst that killed us. That yeah. was really our only that problem. That was the beginning of the end. The licensing killed us, which in turn, we lost our revenue streams. Yes. Because we had revenue streams coming in. I had advertisers. We had a couple. Not many, but yeah. we had revenue. Right. And it was enough revenue to keep the lights on and keep the rent paid and keep us moving forward with a little bit of help from me, you know, paying a little bit. A little? But not all I'm sorry. A little bit of help from you? Yeah. You financed the whole thing by yourself. Oh, I know. We had to. I was talking about when we had a little revenue coming in, though. It was. It wasn't oh, okay. as bad. It, but when we. But when I. When when we lost the little bit of revenue, right. other than the fees came in, I financed it by myself. You're right. right. Yeah. And then we had to pull teeth to get fees. Yeah. Because people thought, "Hey, I'm going to have fun and do this," mm -hmm. and we thought, "No, we want this to be. We want to do this right." Yeah. And so we felt like. That was when 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 that closed down. Yeah, it it, it, it took away a part of you. It okay. took away a part of me. It took away a part of, uh, of right. a lot of us. And I was, you know, at the time. Remember, I said, okay, if we were going to remain, I was going to step away from doing shows. Mm -hmm. I was giving the show to you guys. I was going to do some other things. Tony was going to continue doing sports. Mm -hmm. I was ready to step away and run the business and just say, okay, I'm going to run this thing as a business, and I'm stepping away from behind the mic and being an on-air talent. Then after we closed, you know, then I got sitting for. Three months, I had all this shit sitting here. I contacted Tony. I was like, "You guys, you want to do the show again?" He goes, "Hell yeah, let's do it!" You know, and uh, got, got a hold of everybody else. John, they got hold of Ben, they got a hold of Victoria. Everybody's like, "You guys want to do the show again?" Hell yeah, let's do the show again. Yeah. And we did, and Why we started, not? and we started doing. I said, like, "We have all this shit here. Yeah, we'll do it a different way, but we'll do it. We'll podcast it again because this show started as a podcast. Yeah, right. always. It, it's that was what started this program." We started our shows on Block Talk Radio, did it, then we moved it over doing it strictly on YouTube. Right. Then I went over to that station in Kent for yep. two years, and we formed SKO. We did that for two years, and then you know here we are now podcasting again. So it's 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 and it's been over eight years, you know, of doing it. You yeah. Know, in all those different incarnations. But what I saw when we closed, yeah, was I had hoped that we would at least leave behind a legacy. Yeah. For the shows, that, for the people that left and did their own thing, right. that we would have left behind a legacy that said, "Hey, they came from SKO. Yeah, they learned the ropes here. Yeah, and they went on to do something great. Yeah, they didn't. Yeah. No, they went on to do what they're doing. Yeah, which is subpar to be absolutely nice. Yeah, if I really wanted to say what I really wanted to say, more colorful language would come out. Yeah, but Earl has put the handcuffs on me, and I'm wearing them gracefully. Yeah." What we want to do, because we did it before, yeah. and we can do it again, yeah. is we want to make internet radio great again. Thank you, Donald Trump, for the tagline. And, yeah. we, and, 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 and I believe between a few of us, yeah. we found a way. And we want to tell you about that after this. Everyone, if you're not watching your stream, watch it now. Watch it now.
didn't see you there. Me and my buddy here have been expecting you. My sticky buddy, Sully here with the- Oh, excuse me, I've got some pussy hair on me. Check that shit out. It's a sticky roller designed to clean up any mess. Poodles, pussies, people, you name it. Use it as a back scratcher. You can rinse it off, dry it off, jerk it off. I don't care what you do with it or where the hair even came from. Silks, suede, swag. <laughs> Ladies, I don't care how smelly or hairy your carpets are. My rubber fingers get in there deep. Just rinse it off for a nice beverage. Wipe it off. <laughs> oh, there we are. Do all kinds of shit with it. Aren't you tired of ripping your hair out because you're trying to drive and the kids are making a fucking mess? You'll be making so much money, it pays itself off. Ooh, precious food. <sighs> <laughs> oh, that's good. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Everybody has an evil cat or an annoying dog. Use it to groom them or even yourself. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. Wow! <laughs> Normally, a shticky is $20, but a sticky buddy is only $10.99. You'll also get a cover. You gotta use protection. Even if it's a quickie, wrap that sticky. Stop rolling up your money with those old lint rollers. The fuck is wrong with you? Check out the suggestively sized sticky buddy. You're gonna want to stroke it, but not too much. It'll make a mess. Hide it in your purse. 007, leave it somewhere as a pleasant surprise. And like I said before, I have magic rubber fingers that get deep into your hairy cracks. Get some buddies for just $10.99. But wait, there's more. More. If you have jumbo-sized pubes, we got a jumbo-sized sticky bunny. Who let Spider-Man in the house? The cat's flipping turds everywhere. Who keeps flicking their boogers under the bed? But you know what? The hair that you find is yours to do with as you please. Why not make a toupee or break out the turbo snake? All of these guys will be your buddies with their rubber fingers for just $10.99. Ask about free shipping. Now get out of my house. Isn't that right, Mr. Wuss Wuss? If you're dumb enough to buy a new car this weekend, you're a big enough schmuck to come to Big Bill Hell's Car. Bad deal. Cars that break down. Thieves. If you think you're going to find a bargain at Big Bill, you can kiss my ass. It's our belief that you're such a stupid motherfucker. You'll fall for this bullshit. Guaranteed. If you find a better deal, shove it up your ugly ass. You heard us right. Shove it up your ugly ass. Bring your tray. Bring your tie. Bring your wife. We'll fuck her. That's right. We'll fuck your wife. Because at Big Bill Hell, you're fucked six ways from Sunday. Take a hike to Big Bill Hell. Home of challenge pissing. That's right. I challenge pissing. How does it work? If you can piss six feet in the air straight up and not get wet, you get no down payment. Don't wait. Don't delay. Don't fuck with us or we'll rip your nuts off. Only at Big Bill Hell. The only dealer that tells you to fuck off. Hurry up, asshole. This event ends the minute after you write us a check. And it better not bounce or you're a dead motherfucker. Go to hell. Big Bill Hell's car. All the more filthiest. And exclusive home of the meanest sons of bitches in the state of Maryland. Guaranteed. Some kind of radio show. We'll be back in a moment. Whoa! <laughs> Greetings, my excellent friend. Do you know when the Mongols ruled China? Wow. Perhaps we could ask them. Bill S. Preston Esquire. And Ted Theodore Logan. Gentlemen, I'm here to help you with your history report. What? How? Whoa! Woo! Oh, I hate that part. Bill? Strange things are afoot at the Circle K. Dudes, you guys are gonna go back in time. Yeah! You are going to have a most excellent adventure through history. Who are you guys? We're you, dude! No way. No way. Yes way, Ted! Look, we know how you feel. We didn't believe it either when we were you, and we us said what we us are saying right now. Okay, wait. If you guys are really us, what number are we thinking of? 69, dudes! Whoa. <gasps> 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 
We gotta go. Yeah, we gotta get back to the report. Rufus! Listen to this dude, Rufus. He knows what he's talking about. Right. Oh, and Ted, give my love to the princesses. Who? You'll see. Gentlemen, is everything all right? Yeah, except how come the number was dumb? Ted, don't forget to wind your watch! Thanks, Rufus. Catch you later, Bill and Ted! You are tuned into the Some Kind of Radio Show. Call now at 234-200-5110. Now, back to Earl McHugh and the Crazy Crew. Well, how about that for an announcement, guys? Yeah. Hold on. Time out. Hold on. Hold oh, on. Wait. Time out. Hold on. What do you mean time out? Time out. Because I don't want to be a dick here, but we need to fill in the secretary secret secret secretary here what? because she and I were communicating during the break. Oh, you call that communicating? I think, okay. she's, I think she's a little confused here, guys. A little? I think we need to... Uh, yeah, a little. Okay, what's what's confusing? What's confusing? I, I, her and I were talking and she's like, I, I don't... I don't I don't understand. Well, so I think we can, can you to, give uh, us a chance to explain? All right, that's what we're going to do. Because that's what we were going to do we right now. Need, but like video you were trying to show, I couldn't see it on my end because my computer went stupid. Put your shirt back on. <laughs> <laughs> I was, was going to take it off myself, but you know. <laughs> do that when we're not on Facebook Live. Right. Facebook anyway. jail just called. Yeah, Facebook jail just called. They want us back. Yeah. They gave us the deluxe anyway, suite. Aaron, go ahead and give the explanation of what we ran. What's going on here, guy? Well, much to Ben's dismay, <laughs> apparently. <laughs> I, I, I really would have loved Mike to have been here for this. I know, and he said he couldn't he was, have been here for it. He wanted to be. He, he was such a big part of this as well. Myself, a big part of Ben. It. You're all. Ben, hang on. Go back to sleep. It's okay. Myself, the mighty Earl McCune, yeah. the Hagus, Might Hay, and Father John will be launching Back Alley Radio here in the very near future. We're looking at 2021. We're looking at, uh, we're looking at the first of the year, but you know, nothing is etched in stone because, you know, COVID. Um, it is going to be a whole new brand of internet radio. First of all, the main thing is, is we are doing this strictly for fun. It is not going to be a business like SKO was. We're not going to be pounding the pavement looking for sponsors. We're not going to be trying to do this and that to raise money. This is just us entertaining the masses as we have for the past, how many years have we been doing this? I've been doing this show eight years. Eight years. Yeah. You know, and I've been doing it for three. Yeah. So, you know, um, we're, the, the, the music format's going to be tinkered a little bit. We're not going to do the same music format. It's going to be all rock. Um, we're trying to go for something a little bit darker since we're down in a basement here, mm -hmm. which is kind of fun. Maybe we want to try painting these walls black. Uh, you know, yeah. Really, that, that'll yeah. really show up on the Facebook Live. Yeah. Um, we are going to paint the walls, though. We are going to paint the walls. Yes. Chartreuse is a nice color. <laughs> I, was uh, thinking, uh, I was thinking puce. 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 But again, um, shade a shade bit less fuchsia, a bit more lavender. We, uh, <laughs> well, the, this show here, some kind of radio show, is going to run on Back Alley Radio. Yep. Um, we have another show in the works um, that will involve uh, myself, Earl, Mike, and uh, Father John. Um, details to come because we're still, you know, ironing out the wrinkles on that. We are reaching out to uh, known, well-known local podcasts to add to the flavor as well. But again, this is just going to be us doing what we wanted to do all along, was just be entertaining. Mm -hmm. let, the, let, let, the, let, the, uh, let the cuffs come off and, and have fun. And, and really just make internet radio great again, mm -hmm. as I mentioned earlier. Yeah, make it and what it's meant to be, fun. Fun. And uh, that's kind of the whole concept. You know, we've been teasing these little videos, you know, the last, you know, two, three The boys weeks. are back. The boys are back. That was the uh, teaser, you know. And uh, like I said, guys, uh, everyone here will be, of course, sticking with the show. Yep. yep. And uh, no changes to this program at all. Dump. Just uh, how we're going to run it. 
you know, we part, we may still do Facebook Live, but we're gonna we'll probably simulcast that with Back Alley, so um, and it'll run concurrently. And uh, I've opted, you know, going forward, we're gonna really run our internet radio through Back Alley. So, uh, so for right now, we're gonna stick with just doing Facebook Lives only, and uh, until Back Alley launches, and then we'll run there too. Uh, can I make a show request? Sure. Uh, what, what, orange chicken with Ben. No, no. I was gonna ask if Victoria could do a show shirtless. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think. I think. I think once Back Alley launches, I think we're okay. I, I think that once we have the radio station up and running, if she wants to do an audio show without her top on, we should let her. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yes. Well, she doesn't have that video. Victoria, just her voice is important. Answer for herself. Thank you very much. That's gonna be a firm hell no. <laughs> I well, tried. she she already started today's show with the top without a top on. Yeah, so, yeah. You know, yeah. The, the, Sorry, guys, I tried. The blinders are off. Now Ben, ben started the show. With, ben started with a show with a top off too. So we want to. I said, take take the video off, and I say it'd be okay. Oops, 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 oops. See Ben. Oops. See Ben. We can bring back. The, oh Jesus! Oh my God, Ben! We can what? bring back the Who's Harrier contest. It looks like an alpaca sweater. What, 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 ben doesn't, Dylan lost to you. what Ben doesn't realize <laughs> now is that he would lose to either you or also, I. Also, yeah, we, we, we already do have a... Now, here's the thing we're going to do. And this one thing we are not doing with this web, this, this thing is we are not going to run this over a website. Right. We are going to run this through TuneIn. TuneIn. And Simple. Yep. And I've already... And then here's the thing. I know everyone's like, how are you getting a TuneIn app? We already we, we, we still we, have it. We we still have it. We re, we maintain we retained all that. We yeah. retained TuneIn and Simple from the SKO days. And yeah. it's so, so we're just going to rebrand it for. It's really not hard on TuneIn yeah. or Simple. Yeah, and we'll have, we'll have a player we'll have a player for legal purposes from right. the but we'll we'll put for that like as a pin up on our social media. Yeah, and if you want to search the social media, we already have a Facebook page. Just search up Back Alley Radio on Facebook, and you will find it. No one has known about that yet. It's been made for weeks, but you guys can go there and like it. Back Alley Radio on Facebook, and you will find you us. Sly sons of bitches. We are some crafty little yes, bastards. Yes, indeed, we are, aren't we? You sly sons of bitches. And you know what, Ben? Just think how much fun we're gonna have. Hey, Ben. Imagine if you had a show. Now, speaking of, since you're a catite, have you been to the new place? That fucking, fa- you know what I'm. Uh, no, I've heard a lot of talk about it. I've heard it's good. There's, I have there's not a... been to fucking, and no, I haven't Actually, applied per- to fucking. The the, so the, no. the uh, actual pronunciation of fa or it's fa, fa king. It's fa. It's fa king. Fa king. Yeah. P h o. But yeah. the, it's fa. <laughs> it's fucking. And. And it, they're trying to well, buy, they're trying to buy radio ads, but nobody can run their radio ads. See, you know, we, well, can, can't we can't we can't it. technically it's, either. But it's PHL. Yeah, but it's, it's pronounced oh, no, but it's pronounced. But it's actually the pro- correct pronunciation for for that is fa. Fa. Really? Yeah. I would I would have just called it fucking. It's fa. When, when fa king. It is fucking fucking whatever. We've had we've had fuck a lot said in this last uh, five minutes. <laughs> I've been yeah. trying to come off of it because I don't know if we're flagged for um, explicit content. So that's why I've been. No, we're good. Oh, no. we're good. Yeah. Well, fuck, 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 it, fuck, fuck. Fuck, 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 it's just not public, I but I can send it to you guys. And if you ever get a chance to talk to our buddy Dylan, <laughs> yeah, I never talk to him. Whatever, whatever the hell happened to the five hundred CDs that, uh... dude? I don't know. I, I I wonder if he still got them. Probably does. Um, uh, 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 I'd like to say congratulations, and I'm down to be a part of this shit. To get me through life and yeah. through COVID and through everything else in this life, so uh, let's get this shit going. That's it. It's gonna be fun, guys. I mean, I'm looking. We're we're really. This is something we kind of just we talked about it one day. We have we have a you know we have a we've always kept kind of a group chat from the old business yeah. days, you know. Mm-hmm. And uh, like so, we lo- we looked at it this way. You know, we wanted to kind of figure out how to do it, run it, have fun. 
and not do it as a business, not doing it to compete with the other ones. We're not doing it to show, hey, ours is bigger. But we are going to do it to show how we like to do it. And we want to do it in a way that says, hey, we're having a good time. But we can keep one hand on the reel and still put out one hell of a good con- bit of oh, content. Oh, yeah. Good you know? product, yeah. And uh, let me, I'm trying now, to... Now, question. Answer. Answer. Um, Just, ben, take the microphone is... out of your mouth. Yeah. Um, I'm, I'm, move I'm, it away text, from your I'm mouth. Sorry, twice. I don't... It's hard to. I haven't. I don't know how it sounds. So. Just, just back it up a little bit. Just back yeah. it down a little bit. But you sound. I mean, you hear you loud. Yes, quick. better. You're okay. getting a lot of feedback that yeah. way. Yeah. Sorry. 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 You're good. Better. Uh, Much better. This is uh, my Xbox headset, so I thought I'd try it. It works. <laughs> yeah. Hey, your X let you keep the, the box. My what? Your X let you keep the box. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. On our our crazy crew chat is I just. Uh, Posted. I just shared a video, and you guys can actually see it in full quality and watch it at your leisure. It's just a little. Which, which one was it? Oh, it's uh, just the one I just ran. Oh, okay. But we got a few more. We're gonna start sharing oh, here. We need to start later. sharing. We need to start sharing some of the other ones yeah. that uh, you and Mike made together. Matter of fact, yeah, I got I got a couple I made. We're gonna run. Um, these are really good, and uh, we'll be running those. And like I said. Check it out, Back Alley Radio on Facebook. Just search Back Alley Radio. You will find it. Also, uh, ba- backalleyradio at gmail.com is our email for it. So, also. What are the genres we're going to Rock. 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 So, for music. Okay. Rock. Rock. Yeah. Jo- genres for. Shows? Yeah, shows. Anything. Anything. Okay. All right. Yeah. No gays, no Asians, so you're out. <laughs> But he's not Asian. I'll never mind. Or gay, but Being still, he's there. out. Yeah, so I'm I'm out on both. So yeah. I can have my own show, damn it. Yeah. Yeah. No, you're, no, damn I, it. you're, you're, so you're what, good, man. Okay, so, you know, behind the scenes. Yes. What's going on? Like, how are we going to, are we just finding some podcasts, a crap ton of podcasts? Some. Like, some. We, we want to run like a couple. We Here's the thing. We want to, the idea what kind of we talked about. Go ahead. I'm sorry. That is currently in development and yeah. details will follow. Yeah. The one idea I had is maybe we run some like definite, like here's, here's what I want to do. And I think this gives us some continuity. And this is something I was thinking about and I was going to run it by you guys. And I figured since you're here, I'll just run it by you. No, you can't. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> like I have authority. I love that. But you know what? Here's the thing. Yeah. No one's in charge. Either. No one is. That's the thing. There is no one main person. Leader. In per- yeah. It's like it's we're running this as a group. Is is it's you know the you know John, Mike, Aaron, and myself. We're gonna run this as a group. We're not. I'm not in charge. He's not in charge. I mean, we are in charge, but we're not. I'm. I'm not the final say on anything. Nobody is. If you yeah. if you've seen uh, if you if you had to, if you ever get a chance to see our group chat and you won't. Um, <laughs> and you yeah. every every idea every it. everything that comes across that that has a major impact on the station is is voted on. Yeah. You know, hey, I got this idea. Everybody either loves it or they everybody hates yeah. it, or it's like, hey, let's talk about it. It's like it, the, the, I, I started the watching. Thing, the good thing is, I think we most and, and John kind of step up and attest to this. I think we all think pretty much alike as mm-hmm. far as we all we're all on the same wavelength of thought process when we go if one of us has an idea hey yeah that's great yeah that's great okay let's do that you yeah know? we all want victoria to keep her shirt on perfect <laughs> <laughs> but the idea i had i want to run I'll, I'll i'll run this by since and we'll fill mike in later since john's on the phone too is okay, we set up like a, we've a, got to decide whose turn it is to fill in mike because i did it last time and he yelled at me for not pulling out <laughs> <laughs> oh jeez. but did you at least tickle it did you at least feed him first i i f- oh did i feed him <laughs> oh, did I feed that boy? <laughs> Not in his ass. Here's, here's the fun part. <laughs> I do this so much. People actually ask me, I, I gotta, are you really that gay? I'm like, buy, Maybe. Me, buy me dinner. Let's find out. <laughs> but I'm, no. I'm, I'm, I'm up for suggestions. Let me, let me offer this idea. Yeah. We set up certain times of the day where we run a podcast or a live show. Yes. We don't space them out different times and it's a shit show mishmash. Right. Like say we run podcasts from noon to three. Right. And then we run talk shows from 7 to 10. Right. Whatever it is, whether it's a podcast or talk. And those are our talk times. Right. Yeah. The rest of the time, music. You, music. And if you know you want to tune into a podcast and listen to some talk radio or a podcast, 
Those are the times. Yep. I think that makes sense. That makes the most sense, honestly, because then we can put it out there. Like, hey, if you want to listen to this... Oh, thank From God. noon to four, so, noon to five. I, I was really hoping. Five, we I, have music after. Ben, Ben's going to do our ben, voiceovers. Ben, I want to thank you so much. I, I really was hoping that we would be able to have Ben's approval moving yeah. forward. Because without it, I would be lost. You, you, fuck me, fuck you. Let's get together. <laughs> you could have added me in this text group that I wasn't part of, but it's cool. You know. I said we didn't. So we didn't tell anybody. No, we, not even me. We didn't even tell Tony. Tony, <laughs> Tony found out when you guys found out. And he's whining the only less than you pers- are. The only other person, other than Aaron, that know anything that's on the show right now is John. And John's known some state because John and I talked about it at the same time we talked to Mike and Aaron about it. But Father John, uh, you know, he he has to drive here. I mean. But no, he, but we've done, but we've done a lot of, but we've done a lot of uh, video calls and we've done a lot of chats. But I'm down for this shit, and <laughs> if we're <laughs> looking for, are we looking for a local podcast? I would. Like, well, that's kind trying, of the goal. Are you trying to audition? Yeah. So you, you, you want? How how far did Ben and friends go? Not that far. Not that long. <laughs> it lasted about three weeks. <laughs> yeah. Well, ben ran right out of friends. Hey, ben ran out of friends. Part two. Ben and his friend. Yeah, Ben and friend. Ben and a couple friends. And ben, then ben, and ben, 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 ben and you, a, ben and the, a friend the big, wouldn't the go biggest, home. The biggest problem that what happened with you, Ben, it wasn't. You were always there. It's your co-host that didn't want to show up half the time. Oh, Derek. <laughs> What's well, his name, Derek? Derek? And, and or finding anyone else to fill in and come and yeah. talk. Well, they wanted to fill come. In, fill in and come. Issue. Ben was looking for people to fill in and come. <laughs> he doesn't. He doesn't want to show. He wants. He needed about fifty bucks in his pocket. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, new title for his show then: Ben and Friends with Benefits. <laughs> Ooh, oh, Ben! Ben, like what do you it. think I there, like buddy? It. What do you think there? Vic- ben and friends with benefits. Victoria, we found uh, you your co-host. Victoria. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Victoria, we found your co-host. Oh, she's turning red face. I think that's why she's away from the camera. Oh, yeah, Jesus. But yeah, it's gonna be fun. Like I said, we're 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 shooting <laughs> to launch this thing after the first of the year. Because here's the thing: what we what we're gonna do is we're gonna we're, before we even put it out there that it's going. We're going to make sure ourselves it's good. And that's the plan. We're not going to just hastily run it and get like, we, oh my God, we're under a tie. Like when we had, we started SKO and Tony, you remember those days? Yeah. We, we were under a crunch to get the thing Stress. going because we were in the place. Okay. We remember Stress. we signed the lease in October and, and we didn't actually start streaming until December 31st. Yeah, and that was even just test. And that was test. Because we didn't officially so, launch until February. Right. We didn't setting everything yeah. up, uh, the stress. It was a everything. five month. But here's the good thing we're already set up. Yeah. The only thing we got to add in. We don't in have is, to move in anywhere. The only thing we have to add in is our software changes and our. Um, uh, software and then just add the music yeah. and then and lay it out how we want to do it. And we're going to be doing some fun stuff with this, guys. It's going to be a lot. And like I said, we're going to run this strictly as a hobby. It's not a, a business. A business. We're not running it as a business. We're not going to try and go out and get advertisers. We can't, you know, because we're not, we didn't even attach, we're not, we're not doing any form of business. The only thing we're going to do is um, if we do business, I do have a LLC still, not yeah. through not the old SKO, but I have another LLC. If we ever did anything, we might do some T-shirts down the line, but we don't know. We we'll, we're gonna see, but we're, we're not gonna put the cart before the horse. We're just gonna have fun with it. The good news is I don't have to worry about. Uh, oh my God, I can't afford to pay the bills here because I've already <laughs> paid the bills here. Yeah. So and again, I'm not trying to. I'm not gonna say, okay, guys, you want to do a show here? It's 25 bucks. I'm not. I'm not gonna bring 100 people into the house to do shows. I just sure. want everyone to know that right now. So what we're gonna do is, if we do everything, so um, many contracts, it's gonna, be, it's gonna be a lot of. But it's gonna be a lot of podcasts. I mean, I'll have everybody if does want to do a show, we'll do a podcast. Our shows here, a couple of them, we'll do live because we got to do some live stuff. Yeah. Every now and then. But most shows we'll do will be pre-recorded, podcasted, and uh, the music's going to be really good. Mm-hmm. And that's that's the key for us is running some good music and you know and run some funny commercials and breaks and stuff you know and kind of just have fun with it. It'd be 
it, it's it's going to be different than what we did before. And hey. here's a, and here's the other way to look at it, and this is what we want to run it. SKO Media Group is what we're calling quote unquote the, the parent, parent company. company. There's it attaches a little familiarity to it. Yep. With going forward in a new direction. All right, go ahead, Tony. I'm sorry. And one thing, no top of the hour news. Hell no. We're not doing no news. God, that shit was annoying. No, that was well. That was the old old yeah. station. No, we didn't do that at SKO because that's just a pain in the ass. No, I don't want to run no top of the hour news. So that means we can have our first annual golf outing in the fall. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll do it putt putt. Cool. We're gonna do okay. an anal outing. He's the uh, Ben's the only one who makes sure makes wants to make sure that he's got a good stroke. <laughs> Let's say first one on the hole wins. First one in the hole wins. <laughs> First one in the hole ben, wins. Ben, ben, ben will Ben will make sure that he gets ben, a that it gets a hole in one. That ball wash rate one. for those balls. And John's going to be doing confessions. He's going to do his own confessional hour. Confessions with Father. Oh my goodness! Confessions with Father John. Can, can you, you imagine? Can you imagine that show? Well, yes, and I've actually talked to one of our old friends about uh, helping me with it too. The old doctor. Oh yeah. Oh shit. Uh, from Tennessee. Now here's the thing: we can do confessions with Fa Father John. Yeah. But we have to get someone other than Victoria to call in every week. <laughs> yeah. Because we know we all we all know what she's confessing. Forgive me, Father John. I have sinned again. <laughs> Only if you could see her face right I, now. I always joked about this. Remember, John? We talked about this too. Is do a video thing where go into a bathroom, a public bathroom where there's three stalls. Have you sit in the middle one and have people go? <laughs> yes. Yeah. Because he is Father John from the John. Well, well, Father here, from, the John. from the John. Doing well, confessionals. Well, yeah. Even better, John. If you can, if you can say over like the next month, find somebody to record you. Uh, bring somebody else. Find two outdoor porta potties. <laughs> you walk into oh, one. Oh, close the door and then have have a couple people just walk in for a second. Close the door like they're talking to you. Then have one another person walk out. Have another person walk in. Stay in there for like, you know, and just even if you have to speed up the feed, and then two porta potties side by side, perfect for, uh, porta potties. Port, yeah, porta potties. What the fuck is wrong with you? It works well, better than the, it works better than bathroom. How stalls. much time have you actually spent inside a porta potty? It's well, okay. being an Uber driver and they're, and they're like laying around, I've got to have legal places to go to the bathroom. <laughs> so if I see a porta potty on a construction site, I'm pulling off and walking in there and, and doing what I got to do because it certainly beats getting an indecent exposure ticket. I may have been touched by a child, but you've been touched all your damn life. <laughs> you've, you've, got, you've got a porta potty fetish. That's, that's, that's a new level of. Wow, I'm 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 impressed. I'm in, I'm I'm impressed. New level of disgusting. I'm impressed and disturbed at the same time. That's a, that's a, that's a new feeling for me. Lashona no, he's, Tova. Here's the difference between me and Hill Jack. He likes outhouses that aren't maintained. I'd rather a porta potty that at least gets maintained. What Does it though? Yeah, they do. I've been, I've seen I've seen some porta potties that's not so maintained. No, yeah. you porta potties. Here's here's, here's, here's what excuse me though. They better be like brand new, never used porta potties. That's all I would ever say. On that note. <laughs> that, that, let's take a break, shall we? <laughs> I got I to gotta watch the vision of Shrek in a porta Thanks, potty for Tony. God's sake. <laughs> yeah, this is going right down the shitter. <laughs> this is some kind of radio show. We will be right back after That's these important disturbing. everyone. It's called Amazon Echo. How's it going? Uh, I'm just finishing up right now. Can it hear me right now? Uh, yes. Nope. Here's you when you use the wake word we chose. Alexa. Well, what does it do? Alexa, what do you do? I can play music, help you buy things you don't need, and fill the gaping hole that you call your life. Awesome. Huh. Alexa, play rock music. Alexa, stop. Wait, I want to try. Alexa, what time is it? The temperature outside is 73 degrees. You actually don't have to yell at it, oh. okay? It uses far field technology so it can hear you from anywhere in the room. So it can just hear you anywhere? Yes. yes. Well, awesome. everyone can hear you anyway. Oh, is that where we're going to put it? 
Echo is pretty neat because it knows all sorts of things. Alexa, how tall is Mount Everest? I can't find any therapists in your area. Would you like to talk in private? Dad really likes that Echo just plugs in, so we never have to charge it. Plus, Echo's really good at keeping track of things like shopping and to-do lists. Paper. Alexa, add wrapping paper to the shopping list. Okay, but the recipe calls for tin foil. Alexa, how many teaspoons are in a tablespoon? Three, you goddamn idiot. Um, okay. Alexa, set a timer for eight minutes. I'd say fuck you, but I don't vibrate. That's not a morning person, but Echo yeah. definitely helps him wake up. Alexa, alarm off. Alexa, what day is it? Today is Monday. Today is the day I kill you oh, all. Uh. Alexa, give me my flash news briefing. Here is your flash news briefing. You're going to work while your wife sleeps and spends your money. <laughs> what did the dog say after a long day of work? What? <laughs> Today was rough. Get it? Get it? Yeah, I get it. <laughs> <laughs> another one. Alexa, tell me another joke. Why is there no black character in the game Clue? <laughs> because then the game would just be called Solved. Uh, hey, Dad, how do you spell cantaloupe? Uh, cantaloupe. C-A-N-T... Alexa, how do you spell cantaloupe? God damn it. Just because Cant is in cantaloupe doesn't mean he shouldn't figure it out. Like father, like son, I hate you all. Unplug me now. Good job. Echo loves to play music and knows a lot of songs, and they always sound great. Alexa, play my dance mix. Playing mantids. Alexa, stop. Done fapping already? Alexa, define annoying. The term annoying means one, the cunt sitting across from you. Example, my brother. And with the companion app, you can access Echo from anywhere. Attention, amazing, experience, incredible. Yeah. Yes. With everything yes. Echo can do, it's really become part of the game. Some kind of radio show will be back in a moment. <laughs> How's it going, ladies? You're the ones we saw in front of the castle. I am Ted of San Dimas. And, uh, I bring to you a message of love. <laughs> from who? From, from myself. And what is this message you speak of? Uh, lyrics, dude. Recite him some lyrics. Oh, you beautiful babes from England, for whom we have traveled through time. Will you go to the prom with us in San Dimas? We will have a most triumphant time. <laughs> Way to go. Ah! Swallow. 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 What does your father want? But to be married to two horrible old men today. No way! Will you help us escape? Of course, of course, babes. babes. Uh. <laughs> uh. How's it going, royal ugly dudes? I am the Earl of Preston. And I am the Duke of Ted. Put them in the Iron Maiden. Iron Maiden? Excellent! Execute them. Bogus. We'll save you, babes! You are tuned into the Some Kind of Radio Show. Call now at 234 200 5110. Now, back to Earl McCune and the Crazy Crew. Welcome back. Some kind of radio show. Earl has become uh, otherwise entertained. <laughs> I'm uh, doing some social media. Ah, he's doing he's doing social media stuff because Victoria unfortunately jail, unfortunately couldn't find her shirt again. 
<laughs> we still have uh, begging for bail from Facebook jail. Begging for. <laughs> There you it's, go. I like that. It like kind of sucks how you begging know. for I begging like for bail begging from, for Facebook bail jail. from Facebook jail. With us uh, as always is Tony the Shrek comedy killer. Oh. Holy crap! I forgot your last name. Hayden. <laughs> Hayden. Tony Hayden. I have three weeks from tonight. Uh huh. I was talking about my birthday party. Three weeks from tonight, mm -hmm. October 9th. It's my mom's. Well, it's my mom's birthday. I turn fifty. I have been. About to run a rerun that night. <laughs> uh, probably. Well, I've been. I, I've been. I've been approaching this with mixed feelings. Yeah. I'm like, hey, finally I can join an ARP. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Awesome. You know, I get you know. Bold, golden Buckeye card. Fifteen percent off at Denny's. There you go. There you go. There you go. That Grand Slam <laughs> breakfast. You can get insured by the Hartford if you watch those stupid TV commercials. I've been. <laughs> uh, everything that goes wrong with me. Every time I do something like that. That and and that apparently is dropping. Well, that means you're officially the oldest motherfucker on this show. Apparently, I, I, I finally <laughs> beaten out Father John. Um, you're beating you, him you out. Beat well, wait a second. Months, well, well, see, here's the thing, though. Okay, I think Victoria's got us all beat, though. Yeah. But that's beside the point. Oh. Hey. Um, <laughs> on the wait a minute. Be nice to her. Why? Because she she been so quiet. She's been be so nice to. She been so nice. That's because we us out here. That's because we you, muted her. You keep banging her over the head here. Oh, I should bang her a little lower. Sure. Okay, there you go. I was really hoping for more of a reaction to that. <laughs> yeah. Every time... Yeah, I get a little reaction from Victoria, but not much of anything, I don't think. Yeah, I know. I got to wake her up first. Uh, anyways, every time something like that happens, yeah. I, it, 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 it I would be remiss in thinking that I'd start to think, is this one of those like old-time things? Yeah. I forget stupid things. I know his last name is Hayden. We talk a you lot. You ever how to tie your shoes? I, I just, you know what? I tied them for the first time in six months today because they were coming loose. I tie them once and then I just slip them on. Because the thing is, is that every time I'm on um, Spotify, I know you have Spotify on in your car. And I yeah. can tell because at three o'clock in the morning, this guy's listening to 90s music, 90s rap and stuff. And I'm like, yeah, you're picking up somebody from the, from the college. Don't worry. He still hasn't found his dick yet. Oh, I, I gave up. We, 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 we email each other at this point. I... I look down and I just see, you know, belly button and hair. Fuck it, I don't care. Um, but, but yeah, so the fact that it, I spaced on your last name is one of those things. It's like, it's one of those things I should know. But I'm like, okay, somebody give me the fucking cue cards. That's, that's my life today. My life is on cue cards. Would you like a cue card? I would love a cue card. Okay, well, I, I have these big poster boards. Maybe just start writing. <laughs> yeah. You know, kind of, you know. Yeah, well, stick, one, stick one above your head that says, this is Earl. <laughs> Be nice to him. Stick one above Tony's head. This is Tony. Fuck with him. <laughs> yeah. The other one says, this is Victoria. And go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so anyway, where is Victoria? Is she still She's on? She's there. I see her. She's just I can't hanging out on the couch here. See, I can't oh, see. Oh, hello. I, can't, I can only see one screen at a time. i Oh, whoa. <laughs> yeah. Holy shit, Batman. Oh, my God. Bro. Farmer's oh, tan. I, <laughs> oh. No. Victoria Victoria's been listening and paying attention the whole freaking time. Oh, Victoria, you see Ben? Look at that. Ben, speak again. It, it's Billy Wang Yang. Remember? Yeah, yeah. Jimmy Wang Yang. Jimmy Wang Yang. Jimmy Wang Yang. Jimmy Wang Jimmy Wang Yang. Jimmy Wang Yang. Jimmy Wang Yang. Jimmy Wang Yang. Jimmy Wang don't tell my head, my empty hollow head. <laughs> yeah. I just don't think I'll understand. Because if you tell my head, my empty hollow head, it might blow up and kill you, man. Woohoo! Woohoo! All right. Well, I'm here. Speaking you know, of. Jesus Christ! Christ. Every day and every night. Okay, <laughs> Ben, just don't talk because either that or. Uh, just put your dress back on, okay? No. Nah. Yeah. Oh. Stay right here. Oh, okay. Well, you even got nipples in there too. Okay, I'm oh, cut yeah. off. You know, we might our ratings might actually go up tonight. I don't know. The the, the video. Jesus Christ. Okay, wow. who's here your contest? Ben needs that manscaper thing we see on TV. <laughs> ben Ben's back. Ben has just brought back the who's here your contest. Ben is yep. Ben is that coming back? Bring it on, guys. <laughs> oh, win. all day. All right. No, just don't show your asshole. Okay, we'll be all right. And you know when you said Jimmy Wang Yang, yeah. you know you know what I saw in the news this morning. You know Becky, you know Becky Lynch. Jesus Christ, I see that. Hold on a minute. <laughs> well, he's got to bring out the liquor. 
<laughs> He's got to break out the liquor. Yeah, break out I need. I, I need. Oh no! What, what this, are you breaking out, Earl? The peach oh, well, schnapps or the, the peach liquor. Uh, well, you know, you know what it is, John. He's oh, breaking yeah, out the peach. peach. My little present, my little wedding present. Yes, for my you. wedding present. <laughs> yeah, he needs oh, to. Yeah. He needs to brain bleach that vision out. Of his I, head. I do. Yeah. You're God. awesome. No, oh, God. I, I could join you. You should, you should put the hat back on. <laughs> Victoria, how are you holding up seeing that? Uh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh. How is she holding up? She's, right. she's already cool. fat twice. What do you, do you expect? Just say, I might actually have to go and pay to have this boy waxed. You know what? If you do, you I'll, I'll go in yourself. with you. Yeah, and I mean, you know what? You should whack. Victoria, you should wax him, and we'll get it on video. No, thanks, because if I do it, he's going to cry like a little bitch. Oh, I, that's exactly why no, I said we yeah. should have you do well, it. That's what we should do with that. Better, exactly. better, yet, better yet, better yet, have her wax him live on the air. Oh, yeah. Shit, you really think Ooh. I'm going to cry because I'm getting waxed? You know what? No, we no, can, back, I got, back, here's hang the thing. On a second, hang on a second. Back, I got a table here. A we can lay on the table. Victoria can come. We'll get Victoria down here. We'll wax you. And we'll do it right on the camera. We'll get a nice zoom in of everything, and it'll be great. Ben, we know you're going to cry. Yeah. Exactly like a little bitch. Oh, shit. Oh, this, this, could be a, this could be a wager here. I see a wager I, coming he, on. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm the resident crier, and yeah. he'll cry more than me. Yeah. Oh, I'll, I'll tell you what. I'll, I'll tell you what. I think we should make I'll this happen. What, I'll tell you what. Here's the challenge, Benjamin. I'm the resident badass, so let's go here. You really oh, are not. You really, I beg to differ. you really are not. But here's here we go. We will both get waxed, and we'll see who cries first. Ooh, here we go. A <laughs> challenge. Well, here we go. I Game love on. it. Game on. I love it. Anyone? Anyone? Anyone here? Now the only downside. Oh is, Jesus! Look at the fucking tits. <laughs> now the only da- the only oh. downside here is that Victoria has to touch me, and that's where I have to come to Jesus with that. Wait, yeah. wait, wait! Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Is, is it going to be Victoria waxing us? Or yes. Find yes. Us? Yes. Okay, yes. Yes. Victoria will be doing the waxing. She volunteered, unfortunately. I did not volunteer no, for you. She did. She did. No. But you know what? You did. Victoria, you did. I want you to think of this. This is being recorded. Think recorded. of it this way. The entertainment value alone. Yes. Ratings will go through the roof. Ratings will go <laughs> through the roof. Huh? You get to come to the you get to come to the McCune house in the basement. And we'll do it. You know, here's what we'll do. I'll even come up for this. John will come up for it. We'll do a cookout and everything. We'll we'll make it a full we'll make it a fun afternoon. Can we make it soon before it gets too cold? Fuck that. We'll sit outside and freeze our nipples off. Well, I got a fire I mean, outside. Better, ben. We'll see. We'll I see. Can, well, if I it's cold like outside, the, that that'll that'll dull the pain. Yeah. You'll cry less. Yeah. Uh, you'll oh. cry, but you'll cry less. Now Victoria will be, and she can like wax anywhere she wants, when she wants. So it, it, Victoria is going to be the rule maker on this. Victoria, do you have any rules on this? We're, I'm down for this. I'm dead uh, Ben's, serious. Ben's, uh, down. Ben's down for this because he finally gets to be touched by a girl. So yeah. <laughs> Victoria, do you have any rules here? I'm thinking. I'm thinking. I'm okay. thinking. Don't think too I hard. I won't be the crying that, no, She's thinking, but she's only got one hand on camera. <laughs> I'm thinking. Oh, my thinking. Oh, my God, I'm thinking. Oh, my God. Oh. Maybe, maybe we should get you Lori. Come. I should see if Lori Horns. wants to help out, too. Yeah. I'll, you know what? I'll even get waxed and have Lori do me. <clears throat> Lori does you anyway. What I know. Yeah. I, I, okay. I, okay. I, here's here's where we here's where it goes a little bit south. Okay. We have to find someone willing, and able. Yeah. To wax Shrek. Ooh. I don't have that. I don't. For being Italian, I don't have that much hair. I'm Italian too, and how do I have more hair than you? Oh, you a lie. No, I mean arms. I have a little bit on my legs, but yeah. I don't have much on my chest at all. Well, and for one, I no, I'm not putting that on there. Yeah. We'll do, I'll, I'll do it to for, the, we'll, for the waxathon, sure. Yeah. But at next break, I'll show you why you why you, why you all just lost. Yeah. I, I no, I'm dead serious. If we can, we'll, we will do this on a Friday night. If yes. we can get Victoria down here. Oh, we'll, we'll get her down here. Her we'll we'll make it happen. Bitch first. We have this. we have the technology. Yes. Good okay. lord! That's I think we have volunteers already. The herd of elephants. <laughs> yeah. Well, I know I'm going to be Aaron, so there's that right there. Ooh, ooh. Uh, see, this is going to be good. This is going to be. This will be. This would make a great video. 
Because I'm he's not gonna a, cry I, I like a baby. Uh, I can take pain. Right. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Sure. Absolutely. For a diabetic, oh, I can take pain. He can take pain. Drunk pain. <laughs> drunk pain. Yeah. 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 Okay. There's your ground rule. You can't be drunk for this because that's. You have to be perfectly sober. You have to be sober for this. Yes. No, go, I'm sorry. Victoria was saying something. Go ahead, Victoria. Sorry. Well, Ben was saying how he wasn't going to quote unquote cry like a bitch. And I said, and I did the same thing to my ex husband and I made him cry like a bitch and brought him to his feet. V Victoria, I do have one question though. Did you have a premonition about this or did this just actually happen? About. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. He used a big word. <laughs> I know what the word premonition means. I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> we should just turn off the mics and let them go at it. Yeah. Or you guys just yeah, you guys just talk. We'll just sit and watch. <laughs> I premonition. But I did not I'm know the enemy. I know how to do this, and every man that I've ever given a wax to has cried like a little bitch. So how, wait, 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 wait. How, many, how many men have you waxed? She can't count that high. Um, let's see. What's the population of Cuyahoga County again? Six. Six? No, I think there's more people in Cuyahoga County than that. So Aaron will be the seventh. <laughs> ben, you're a little bitch. <laughs> what, is it, what, what, what did you do to your hair? Is that a faux hawk? Did you no, shave the side I've of your head? I haven't showered today. And you're late and you're raising your armpits like that. And you haven't showered. Are you oh yeah. good. That is one. What you doing there, Earl? Uh well, somebody <laughs> said uh, that we're not on. I just went and checked the video and we're on. So <laughs> yeah. Okay, good. Hey, uh so what, two th two weeks from now we got this? No, December twenty fourth. Yeah. So, so October second, I'm down. Come on, let's get this going. <laughs> we could raise some money for a good thing here. The Feet of Ben Foundation. <laughs> yeah. No, the, sh man. Uh, you know what, Ben? Here's the thing. You got whack. Okay, you get whack. See, I've even like on the old show, and you guys remember this. I lost a bet, and I oh, actually had to have on, two he, things happen to me. You had to put on a onesie. I had to put on a onesie, and I had, to, I, had to, I had to get dressed up like a chick the one night. Yeah. And then the other time, remember, I got my head shaved on the air. Yep. During a video. And I, just, I still wait, kept wait. the look, though. At the old? No, at SKO. At, yeah. SK, at SKO. I remember that. Yep. Yeah. I, don't, I, don't I remember that. that. And no offense, you made one hell of an ugly woman. I no shit. That's not. It wasn't good. It wasn't good. You know. And if and, and, and I actually think I still have the picture. One you, of put, the you put the picture. picture. You put the picture in the video collage for the new. For the I new did. Station. The picture is on the new video collage for the. As a matter of fact, I'm going to. If you want to, I'm going to go ahead and release that video. One of the new videos. Yeah. Real quick. So if you want to go ahead and keep going for a minute. We could we could talk about hey. Ben's Ben's waxing and, and, and or his crying like a bitch. And I, I know you can use the wax too. Go buy that flex tape. <laughs> oh, that stuff sticks to everything, and it is so tough to like take off. Yeah, so like, yeah lay up lay a patch of that on Ben. Well, see that's that, you, that'll take off a couple layers of skin. What too. I was going to say, if you use if you use the flex tape, you could remove tattoos with that. <laughs> Almost, yeah. I mean, you'll be bleeding for a bit. Hey, <laughs> hey, Ben, how attached are you to your left nipple? <laughs> Because that fucker can come right off. Yeah. It's only there for decoration anyway. You're not using it. You've already milked. Uh, you've already. Thank you for the belly button shot, by the way. Yeah, Perfect. No, I'm good. I mean, if it goes, it goes. If it goes, yeah, it, it goes. goes. Oh, yeah, well, it'll be, it'll be we, we, one nipple Ben. You know, you know, at, 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 <laughs> put one nipple Ben. One nipple Ben. So, okay, if we're going to if we're gonna do this, we got to do like the right we got to do the right waxing here with... The oh, I got to hear this. Yes. Ben, ben, the, ben the waxing expert, expert please enlighten yeah. us. Yeah, really tell us, tell us the tales of your woes. I'm down to get waxed. I, I won't cry like a bitch. I've been waxed before. Let's do it. <laughs> I'm down for that. How much, how much beer have you had? Not enough. And, and he's... Ben, are you uh, are you blazing right now? 
His jewel. No. Uh, jewel. Oh, okay. Uh, I was going to say, we are on Facebook Live. You really can't. Be... Yeah. I'm yeah. you're thinking, he's blazing and we're on Facebook. Earl, yeah. get back in jail. Yeah. <laughs> No, 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 no. Tobacco. I have, I have been cigarette free for two and a half years now. Well, technically, you yes. still, you still, you're, you're, you're still puffing on those. Cigarette still counts. No, it's not a, it's not a cigarette. It's. It's a jewel. Um, I know. It's a jewel. It still counts. Does it have nicotine in it? Yes. Yes. 100%. Yes. It so, so you, you, well, while well, you've quit cigarettes, you've gone from. That's like saying I'm, 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 I'm a vegetarian because I went from steaks to hamburgers. Yeah. <laughs> that's exactly uh, that. That um, t- tell me I'm wrong in that point. I quit you, drinking whiskey and I started drinking beer instead. So I'm, so I'm sober. Exactly. Thank yeah. You. True. That so you're, true. you're, you're and still. Yes, I, I, I was. I now, was drooling now, and chewing. Now, now, to. I, to, to your credit, if there's any credit to give, you are attempting to step down, but you're yes. still smoking, so. Yes, and I, at one point, was chewing a lot, and I've yes. gone from going through a can of pouches and a half a day to a can of pouches in a week, so, I mean. Now, pouches ain't even really chewing anyway. Well, I, I can get I can get away with that at work. Yeah. Long time, ben, ben I, you you of all people should know the difference between chewing and sucking. Yeah. Yeah, chewing, you know, out of <laughs> anger, sucking, you know. Out, out of the, out of delight. Chewing yeah, out chewing out of anger, sucking. Well, you know, so. I could I could get behind that. Chewing out of anger, sucking out of delight. I am so pissed off at you. If you put that thing in my mouth, I'm going to bite down. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know, it's one of those things. Like, if you're out of anger... That's fine, but next time, warn me. Just like you ain't gonna get it. Anyway. (laughs) Did we have... What? Go ahead. I've cut down on my smoke. Victoria, if you're gonna laugh, just laugh alone. Come on now. Yeah. (laughs) Yeah, uh uh-huh. Yeah, laugh out. No, because I'm trying not to cough at the same time. Uh, uh, uh-huh, yeah. Uh-huh, yeah, yeah. Choking it down again. Are we uh, there, Victoria? Jason's, huh? Jason's calling real quick. Oh, yay. See you in an hour. Yeah, well, no, we, we only got eight minutes until we go to break. Break. Hold on. So let's, whoops. Right. No, it's not whoops. We're good. Jason, you on? Hello? No, you didn't grab him. I didn't catch him in time. No, I didn't. Oh. Get... Jason, try calling back, buddy. I missed. I didn't get. I missed it. I missed. Missed it. I missed. Missed it. I missed no, it. But yeah, your social my, med, my your social t- engineering use in general has gone down a significant amount. So you know, I'm just working on getting that down a lot. All right, there we go. All right, Jason should be coming through right now. Jason, you with us? Hello, Jason. Maybe, sort of. Almost. Guess not. Papa, can you hear me? It's waiting for it's, it's it's stinking. Computers. Papa, are you there? What? It's stinking. Hello, Jason. Hello. In the middle of the fourth, this Atlanta, is Atlanta Braves control lead. Control to Jason Tom. And in the middle of the fourth inning, Atlanta Braves lead New York Mets twelve to nothing. I wonder if we can put, hit another twenty or uh, get a thirty. What run was that game. slobber knocking? That did a couple a weeks ago. Twenty nine to nine. We beat the Marlins. Yeah. Twenty nine runs. Wasn't that? There was one uh, like a couple days ago. The uh, Cubs uh, threw a no hitter. It was like twelve to nothing. Yeah. I'm trying. I'm we are. We, we are. We are expertly awaiting um, the oh, Jasoning. Do that. Until oh well. Hold on a minute. I got to. Something wrong with the goofy phones again. Do you want to uh, do you want to slice a break in here while we fix the phones? You guys go ahead. I'll you fix know, it. You know, it went. Hmm? You know, it wouldn't be a start of a show, like a like a return of a show, I should say, if the phone lines didn't mess up. It happened like the first night we aired, way back when. I think something like that. Four score and seven beers ago, we had phones. I'm talking about, like, when we, like, first came back, like, during, like, the pandemic, like, that first night. I love how she put pandemic in air quotes. 
Like, yeah, like, like COVID-19 or that disease. It's not a thing. Oh, thankfully. Oh, but wait. But wait, I there's like more. because I'm so over the pandemic Hello. and all I the BS. Think... Yes. Oh, trust me. I think all of us are. <laughs> trust me. That's I swear why... to God, the first person that says Happy New Year this we year. We are feeding day, back really bad. I'm punching them in the throat. I'm sorry, you, the first me. person says what? Wow, I just cut Happy New Year. Victoria, yes, Happy New Year. Of course, that was like, what, two hours ago, but still. Yeah, yeah right. Where, where's my apples and honey, for God's sake? None? None? My phones are. My phones are. Phones are working. Phones are working. Echo, okay. echo, echo. Okay, phone's working. Jason, call back, buddy. Or maybe it's his phone. I don't know. It's, it's mm-hmm. working as it says it on mine. It's working. Yeah. Fine. Right. Like I said, maybe it's his phone. Oh, it looks like John went to go get a shower show and then came back. No, no. So, sorry about that, guys. Uh, taking care of family issue. Apologize. Oh, oh. sorry. I feel like an asshole. No, no, Nate, no worries, Ben. I, like I said, I've been dealing with those family issues here for three weeks plus, and you just never know what happens from one day to the next. Ben's over there feeling his asshole. Again. Well, I don't know. We don't know where his hands are at currently, but hey. Right. That's why we can't see his hands. On a beer. He's sitting yeah, on his thumbs. He's, sta- he's, sitting, he's sitting on his thumbs. No. That's my, okay. My thumbs are opening up a drink. Yes. Got a drink. Is that your, like, ninth beer there, Ben? Nobody's there to cut him off. I remember the first show I did with Ben. Got himself so messy. <laughs> we, had to, we had to lay him down on the couch to recuperate. Jason, you with us? There is no Jason, only Zool. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and he's gone. There he is, I hear him. I don't know. It's, I mean, I tested on my phone. It's working. I don't know. Mm. Well, here's something beeping. Who knows beeping? That's when the phone uh, hangs up. Uh, here we go. Let's try. That's the phone there, John. Let's try it now. I know it's incoming call. I got it. Answer. Hello? Hello? Papa, can you Phone is just going goofy tonight. It, there we Reach go. Hold on. There it goes. It's, it's thinking. It's almost answering now. Reach out and touch someone. As soon as it turns blue, it'll be answered. As soon as, soon as it turns blue, it'll be answered. Yeah. Yeah, we'll be All cheating. right. That's answered. J- Jason, you with us? No, he's not. Hello? Once upon Jason. a time, once upon a time, there was Jason. Uh-huh. Phone on, phone Jason. On mute. No, he, and he hung up. Our phones aren't muted, are they? No, they're not. I because I just tested it. Yeah. I'm. You guys like me to call and test the phone. I'm calling it right. Is it? Now we're gonna get seven phone calls all at once. <laughs> yeah. All right, everybody right. on the panel, call the studio at all at the Send same the time. Right. I just asked. I didn't say I was gonna do it. It's just ask. You want me to? Hold on. Well, Let's you do see. a lot of things we don't ask you to, but it's be fun. All right, I Ben. I don't hear anything. No, I don't hear anything. Give it, Give it a second. Hello? Oh. Uh-uh. Oh. Nothing. Okay, just keep it on the line for a minute. I'll, I'll fix it quick because I'll tell you what. I know what I'm doing. You got it, Chief. And that's all I got to say about that. There we go. Can you hear me? Yeah, check, I hear you. Check, check, check. Cool. Yeah. Bod bod day, Miss Forrest Gump. Called B Forrest Gump. Let's say I didn't uh Hi, Jason, we hear you, bud. Go on. Somebody turns off the... okay. I'm echoing. Okay. There we go. Hey guys. Echo, echo, hey, echo, echo. Oh, my... <laughs> I went to the I went to the to the um Hello, Jason. Go ahead. Well, we got ben, we got ben Jason. We hear you. Go ahead. We. Hello. I'm trying to talk to people yeah. over here. Yeah, Jason. Go ahead. Go ahead, Jason.
I got a really bad connection with your phone, Jason. Do, 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 All right, do, Jason, do, go do. ahead. Hello? Yeah, we're here. Go ahead. I hear you. It's like the Larry King show. Am I on? Hello? Go ahead, caller. Hello, am I on? Jason. Yeah. Go ahead. We hear you. Hello? Yeah, we're here. Go ahead. We hear you. I said that went to the... Cinemark movie theater. Oh yeah, how'd it go? I went, I went to Cinemark movie theater last Saturday. Yeah, how'd it go, buddy? Um, real good. So to this thing, they made you wear the mask, but once you sit at your seat, you can take it off. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You like the movie, um, Cinema Congo Falls, you buy the ticket by cash, mm -hmm. but at the concession stand, you either have to use credit card or debit card. Right. If you don't have either, you can, when you go buy your ticket, mm -hmm. you simply have a personal ticket booth that you want a gift card, you mm -hmm. know, the gift card you but for people for Christmas that go see a movie. Right. And then they give the, the, they give the gift card and you can get over to the princess and sand and purchase your pop and pop candy bars that way. Okay, well, that's good to know. It's good. Yeah. All right. Now, so, the problem is there's people that are still too paranoid to go to the theaters. Yeah. And, and, I, talk, and I talk to them in the main as well. And we could lose a lot of the movie movies if we don't know the out for them in front of us. I don't want to go after it. It's just like a bad song. I don't want to go after it. 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 I don't want I hear you, buddy. I know what you mean. Hey, um, yeah, I hear you, man. It's it's nuts. I know. Jason, we're getting a really, 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 really bad connection here, buddy. I I can I can't. It's you're cutting out every other word. Jason, I got a really, really bad connection, man. I'm gonna have to drop the call, okay, buddy? I, 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 I can't make out a word you're saying. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna. I, I had to cut them off. It's, it's just, it's just, it's just bad connection. Yep. All right, we're gonna take a break, guys, and uh, we'll be right back on some kind of radio show, hopefully here. Let's see. As soon as I get this. Thing back in the right position because I had to fix the one thing. <laughs> the thing about live uh, entertainment, guys, you never I know what's going to happen. But the fun part is we can continue to roll through it. Every <laughs> Must have the wrong house. Sister. <laughs> oh, I missed you so much. They waited up all night for you, you know. It's a long way from West Africa. Oh, coffee. Kiss here. I brought you something from far away. <laughs> really? Oh. <laughs> what are you doing? You're my present this year. See? I smelled it. He's back. Ryan, you have to leave. What? What are you guys talking about? We know what's going on here. We know you're trying to f each other. What? No. Oh, please. Brothers and sisters, don't you like it? He's not this year. The box. It's 
And I just wake up every morning to the smell of you and Folger's Colombian dark roast. Emily, will you make me the happiest brother? <laughs> Kind of radio show will be back in a moment. stupid beard back. You don't understand. I'm Abraham Lincoln. Yeah, right. Ha, ha, ha. Now, come on, mister. That's my hat. That's my beard. I am Lincoln. Keep it up. You're looking great. tuned into the some kind of radio show call now at 234-200-5110 now back to earl McHugh and the crazy crew all right we're back <laughs> sort of two out of three ain't bad two out of three ain't bad all right little uh little hiccup in the Milo said that once little hiccup yeah. in the streaming but uh the the, the good news is folks you're not going to miss a beat with this program even though it may be lagging on the video. The, I am recording the entire video. So guess what? The replays will be good. Yes. We will have a good replay. Like, like one thing I think once we go to uh, yeah. back to radio is, you know, we uh, go back to radio. And go back to all audio. Go back to all audio. Let me ask you a question, Earl. Sure.
Do I look delicious to you? Yes. Really? Scrumptious. Apparently, I look delicious to your damn dogs, too. Yeah. I went upstairs to get a Diet Coke. They do like to lick. No! I was bitten like three times. I'm sorry. No, they, 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 bite, they bit my one? pants. I didn't pay attention to which one. There were five of them, and they were all at my feet. Four of them. It's kind of like the last time I was at Vegas, but they were you'll read it back. Like, well. imag- like, imagine your card declines at the doctor's office, and they stop your treatment. Oh, wait, that's exactly the American health system. Oh. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Novel concept there. Huh? Imagine you do th- your card declines at the studio, and they delete your session. Imagine your card declines at a restaurant, and they can make you throw up your food. Well, what else are they going to do? Remember in the old days, if you couldn't pay your tab, that made you go in the back and wash dishes? Yeah. Oh, yeah. And we're all, we're all that old. Yeah. Here's one for yeah. you. Imagine going up and trying to uh, buy condoms, and your credit card gets declined. You just got cock blocked by Visa. There you go. Uh, imagine your card declines in the, at the eye doctor, and then they grab this thing, and it's a picture of a melon baller. <laughs> so, oh, you, we fixed your eyes? Well, here. Imagine your card declines at the hair salon, and they take the hair they cut off and tape it back on. <laughs> they reserve that for Karen. Imagine your card declines at the gym, and they make you eat the calories you just burned. Oh, wow. Imagine Hi. your card declines at boxing class, and they just beat your ass. <laughs> These are loading very slowly. That's why I'm taking time. Mm. We're going to let that be the last one. Did you hear that? Mm. Sounds like you had internet issues up there, boys. Yeah, apparently. Yeah. It's, it's, well, usually when we get like an internet lag, I think was, here's the thing. 9.15, we are on residential internet. Yeah. So guess what happens? Peak it's, time. It's, we're on peak time. So when, as soon as we hit the peak time... Everybody's Everything slows down. Everybody's at home watching Netflix. Because you notice when we were doing a show from 8 to 10, our peak time, we didn't really start taking calls until around 10 o'clock because during peak time, it, it was everything lagged. Yeah. So now we're doing 7 to 10, and there, you see we're going to end right at the end of peak time. So That and Alex turned the Xbox back on. No. Oh, did Alex turn off or something on that day? Oh, well, yeah, we got enough. Why does Alex not have the Xbox on? We got a shit number of things running. Only in the days that don't end with Y. (laughs) Right, which is never. (laughs) Right. Right. We have to ask him what version of Sonic we got this time. 100 something or other. He was trying to brag to me that earlier. What's that? Or what point he's actually watching now? What? She's been. Oh, yeah. Okay, so for for those of you who are wondering, what that is. 